fluffy. No. No. It's time to get a life. I've been locked in my mum's garage for the last 20 years, and now I want to find out what happened to my dad and become the best fighter in the world. This game is amazing. Hi, I'm Mad Morph, and this is Punch Club 2. Let me know in a comment when you spot a movie reference on the screen. I spotted some of them. I'm sure there are some that I missed or didn't understand. So let's try and spot them and let me know below. Also, let me know in a comment if you want to see more of it. This is the complete chapter one playthrough, and I'd be happy to do some more. So let me know if you enjoy it. Now, hit that like and subscribe, and let's begin Punch Club 2. Find all of my socials and my podcast at Bedtime Stories below this video, or at madmorph.com, which has all of my links. Enjoy. Fluffy. No. No. There's no other choice. You killed our father. It's payback time. I am your father. Give me your other paw. No. Whoa, what a strange dream I just had. Thank God it's over. Morning, son. How did you sleep? Ah, oh, don't ask. Nightmares again. Hand me my favorite sweets, please. <clears throat> Holy smokes. There's something wrong, sweetheart. You're a giant slime, Mom. You shouldn't talk to your mother like that. No, I mean, literally. Look. People change over the years. But that's not the most important thing right now. Then what is the most important thing? None of this is real. You and I never met in real life. Dad, I don't understand. Dad, do you think of your father? What have you done with my parents, Lion Punk? What do you think you can do, huh? I'll punch your face! Oh, really? You won't scare me with your tricks. I'll beat everyone who threatens my family. Like, everyone. Uh, come on, son. Punch me in the head. That's an order. What's going on here? You punch like a sissy. I'll show you a punch. place. I saw it in my dream. Sometimes everything in life comes down to a single moment. One single fight. The fight ahead of you can't be won with punches and kicks. Not even... Not even with a huge crowbar, son. Father. I'm afraid. I can't do it without you. But you have to. Please don't leave me. Find me in the upper city. an amazing opening. Prolog, you... What a crazy dream. Uh, time for the daily routine. These graphics look absolutely gorge. Oh my god. Love this style. Back on the map. Pump it, baby. We need to eat. Hello, Mr. Spencer. Time for breakfast. Invalid request. That never happened before. Let's try that again. Invalid request. No food available. Maybe it's jammed. Come on, Mr. Spencer. Work with me here. Invalid request. No food available. This situation calls for someone more competent. Ma, <laughs> Mommy! Wake up, Mum. 
Huh? I'm hungry. Use the food dispenser. I tried that. It just says no food available. Maybe we should call the technician. They'd probably be surprised we were getting any food in the first place. You mean, all this time we've been stealing our food? Of course not, son. Phew. We just weren't paying for it. That's literally what stealing is. What do you want from me? I'm a poor, sick woman. Here we go again. I gave you the best years of my life to a man who... Um... Abandoned me. Pregnante. Not this again. I'll just go ask Henry then. Jeez. <laughs> Without a single word of explanation, I raised you, all alone, as best I could. So what if I cut a few corners here and there? Any self-respecting mother would do the same thing. Is she gonna keep going? Okay, she's good. Let's turn the music down a little bit. It's quite loud. Okay. Let's go this to the town. The music's like way over the sound effects. Henry's house. Look at this city. So much to explore. Good morning, Henry. I feel like the music's still way too loud, actually, so we can have this up. There we go. If it isn't my favorite neighbor. What's up, mate? Come by for another retro movie. <laughs> Actually, I've got a problem. What happened? The food dispenser stopped working. You try punching it? They blocked it. Turns out we've been stealing food all this time. That's not good. It's not like you knew, right? Sorry, let me put it up. Just get it, we'll get it right. Hang on, we'll get the balance. What are we supposed to eat now? You know, you could just buy something at the shop, right? The pink slippers! But that's outside the neighborhood. M mum would never let me go. With all due respect to your mum, you're old enough to be on your own. But she... She'll be cool with you buying a hamburger for your favorite neighbor. I guess. Yeah, use the change to buy yourself some breakfast, all right. But the shop's practically around the corner. Grow up, kid. <laughs> Yo, this pad, though. I've been thinking about, like, trying to, like, look into getting a projector or something recently. Is this me? Is this my room? Is this my future? Oh, boy. Oh, God. I literally thought how cool it would be to have a popcorn machine. But I don't eat enough popcorn if I got a popcorn machine in my little movie room. Like, what? You know? It's just going to be a waste of popcorn, so I just have little packs of it instead, but God, I would love, I would love a, like, projection area or something, or one day having enough space for, like, a little cinema room. I see these ones of people on, like, TikTok, and they have their basements turned into full-on, like, cinemas and stuff. It's so cool. All right, to the shop. Good morning. Is something wrong? Your head in a jar. And you're talking. <laughs> My friend, yes. You're very observant. What can I do for you? Bye. Why? I was going to buy myself the body of a young athlete, so I sold my old one, but before I could purchase the replacement, there was a crisis. Stupid slimes. The food market kind of crashed, so now I have to look like this. Okay, buddy, just press the green button to buy the items. I know you can manage that. I mean, how else would you have gotten this game? Unless, of course, you torrented it, which is illegal. Let's get the burger. 
in the cooking kit. I'm loving this so far. Present your chip for payment verification, please. What chip? Your GPP chip, of course. I don't have one. That's nonsense. Every citizen has one. Let's see it, please. What's up, Apu? Oh, hello, Mr. Bobo Jr. Have you come to rob me again? Yep. Open the register, please. A robbery? Not on my watch. I'll save you, Mr. Talking Pickle Jar. What? What? I said... We heard... We heard, but how about you just take this chocolate bar and piss off? Because I'm a... Wait, it's a Slickers? Oh, nice. Are you sure you're ready to part with it just like that? <laughs> Please, take it. I'll rob the store and get myself some more. <laughs> ah, that's sweet. <laughs> Thanks. Sorry to interrupt you, but can we get back to the robbery? Oh, I almost forgot. Get ready to fight, you thoughtful <laughs> Insert abilities in slots. Each row has a specialization. I'm Mr. DNA. Let's use an attack. Pick one of the availables. Kick him. The more abilities you choose, the more school perks will be activated. Okay. So this is their stuff, and this is us. So we throw in a... Kick, no attack, no attack. So save energy. Kick, punch, it's all in the mind. Okay, and then restore energy, I guess. Bam. Oh, bam. Oh. Stop right there, you delinquent skunks. But I... But he... I don't want to hear a word of it. Rule of the fist. You're both headed to the police station. Bam. Thanks for not writing me out, man. That would have been hella bad for my GPP. Snitches get stitches. Ah, uh, look, Demolition Man reference over here, Wesley Snipes. Still want to thank you, though. Come by the slime farm if you need a job. Sorry, I got excited. I like Demolition Man. New goal, find out about little Bobo's job. All right, cool. This is moving so fast. The pace on this game, the story is crazy. Now tell me, son, what have you done to your GPP chip? I never had one, sir. No idea what this GPP thing even stands for. How on earth is that possible? Well, Mum has never let me leave the house, so... Now that's a shame. Your father wouldn't approve of that. Did you know my father? Mum never told me anything about him. Goal complete. He was a fighter, one of the greats. The rest of the info is classified, though. I wonder if our dad was the guy in the first game. I need to know, sir. It's very important. To access that information, son, you'd have to be a police officer. Okay, if you say so, I'm ready. <laughs> Not so fast, you eager little beaver. First, you'll need 2,000 GPP and learn all the laws. Get 2,000 GPP. Hmm, becoming a cop. That does sound awesome. And about that brawl you had in Apu's shop, I'm not going to charge you. Yay. But you don't leave the police station without a chip in your head. How do I know it's not going to control me? Ah, 
I love this guy. That's exactly what it's for, but it's for your own good. Listen. GPP means good person points. The more you have, the better you are. Getting over 9,000 officially makes you a good person. That's when you get into Upper City, where all your dreams come true. How can I get them? What do you think your good person points are at out of 9,000? Stick it in a comment. Usually people get into GPP for contributions to science, charity, the arts. Like a deadly martial arts tournament? Yeah, in your case, that's probably your best plan. Let's make you a full member of our glorious society by hitting that subscribe button. Now you have a chip. You look like that fight took a lot out of you. A little food wouldn't hurt. Some cute criminal gave me a chocolate bar. So eat it. I remember back when I could do that. Oh, that sweet buttery nougat. Hey you, you hungry? Have a look in your multi-passport. Maybe there's something edible in there. This is where you find any food you picked up. <laughs> Choose what you want to eat. Mmm, delicious. <laughs> Just don't even do it on the snacks, big boy. You don't want mum to start swearing. Why does that thing look baked? Oh, one last thing. Every fighter should visit Silver's Gym. It's the best place for training. Sure, but first I need to have a serious talk with my mom. Where's Lee Snipes? Back home. Mom! Where were you? I've been worried sick. Why have you been lying about my father? What? Did you dare talk to me like that, young man? Just tell me, please. Did he go missing? Your father was a fighter. The greatest fighter there ever was. Maybe a little too great for his own good. Right after I found out I was pregnante, he entered the biggest tournament of the La Planet. <laughs> Mama, opened your voice. Don't worry about it. I tried to tell him, but he wouldn't listen. Later, Andre, I need to focus. Naturally, he won, and after that, gone. Poof. Did he leave? Was murdered? I don't know. No idea. All the same to me. Who's that in the background? Frankly, he never cared about me. About us. Why should we care about him? Sorry, but distracted by this murder. Where have you been? I've been to the police. They know something about him, unlike you. And they're taking me in. All they ever do is f have fist fights with each other and the citizens. What's it called? Rule of the Fist. You're just begging for a bunch of bruises and concussions. What other choice do I have? To be a rocket scientist if this city lives by the fist I shall be the greatest um fister fist man anyway I'm gonna be just like my father and that's final <laughs> no butts you've been holding me back for way too long maybe some butts and now if you'll excuse me I have a job interview to attend <laughs> Chapter 1 Big City Life Have you eaten? Uh, no, I'm still hungry. 
<laughs> Better grab something before you go, big guy. Fridge. Cooking kit. The preparation time is here. So that's how long it takes to make something. Let's see what the Brave New World has in store for you. Story. Quest tree. Bring Henry the burger he asked for. Or talk with little Bobo about working on the farm. Or visit Silver's gym. It's up to you, you, you. Good luck, buddy, buddy, buddy. Okay, we're back, we're in. That was a bloody good intro. I'm like so into this right now. Let's take our friend his burger, I think. I'll walk. Hello, Henry. Here's your burger. Sorry it took so long. Thanks, mate. What happened? I kind of got arrested. Wow. You're right. Actually, they offered me a job. And a chance to find out what happened to my father. Told you, kid. And about that money? Oh, I never wanted it back. The change was yours all along. Right. Get it? It's a pun. Because I helped you change your ways and... You've been watching way too many corny movies, Henry. The Burger of Change. Uh, by the way, uh, do you want to catch a movie with me? Just like the good old days. What movie? An old action movie from the 80s. Yeah. You're gonna love it. After 90 exciting minutes. That was awesome. Yeah, good old action movies. I grew up on them. I came here to eat ice cream and whoop your asses. <laughs> and I've already finished my ice cream. And then that way you left to beat their asses. And the beginning was cool too. You just stepped over the barbell. And that step was your last. Never step over the barbell. Wow, that was a good movie. Look, you got some old school respect. Oh, nice. What can we do with it? Old school respect. Perks from the movie that you can unlock. What? Perks make you look cool while doing your thing. Choose a perk that's cooler than the rest. Barbell pocket, barbell sprint, the basics. Increase the effectiveness of push-ups. Sounds good. Okay. We had a great time, neighbor. If you want to go again, I remember Apu has some old tapes. I hope he doesn't need them right now. Get them from him. I'll ask him. Get a tape. Cool. Oh. I need your clothes, your boots, and your motorcycle. <laughs> yeah, classic. <laughs> This is so well written. Let's go to the farm. Mm, it's gonna take me, is that an hour? Or a minute, an hour I would think. Yeah, okay. Um, hello? And who are you? Dad, this is the guy I was telling you about. Oh, you're here for a job, right? Yes. Well, the job is yours, as long as you can punch slimes nice and hard. And let's face it, any idiot can manage that. Is this a Dune reference? I've got more important business to attend to. So this is what you do? Helping your father on the farm? Yeah, I have to. Sounds like you don't really like it. It's not like anybody ever asked me what I want. What are you after? 
I've always felt like there's more to life, you know? More than this dirty town and its endless gang wars and all the illegal activities and stuff. But there's nobody here, not even my father, who believes in a better life. But I've got a plan. If I can score enough GPP, I can get out of this dirty city and leave it all behind. How are you going to do it? We don't know each other well enough for me to tell you everything. Maybe later. We use them for the food dispensers. What? You mean, all my life I've been eating this? Yep. Never complained about the flavor, am I right? I guess not, but that's... You're welcome. I better get to work. Have fun punching slimes. Are you out of your mind? Excuse me? Do you see what time it is? It's time to sleep or do crime, but obviously not to work. Come back at eight. We try working a night shift before. The sounds of slime pounding kept everybody awake within five kilometers. Jiggly boob man. All right, I'll go home. Sleep. To my room in the garage, sleeping on a lawn chair. Oh my god, mom, why don't I have a proper bed, mom? Jeez, why? Why do I live this way? Wait, I just slept and it's now midnight? Why can't I sleep through the night? What? Guess I'll work out. Ha. <sighs> hey. Ha. Who? Work out till morning. Now, what's that done with my energy? Still pretty full. All right, I'll just work out till morning. Wait, what's going down? My food. So as I work out, food and energy goes down. All right, 5 a.m. See if I got some more food. Oh, that was it. Okay. 35 doodlers to my name. Let's go. S well, the gym opens. That time. Go buy some food. Uh, hello, Mr. Fishbowl. Ah, if it isn't the young fighter himself, how was your encounter with the law? It was okay. I have a GPP chip now. Let's see. You sure do. Want to buy something? Well, actually, I was wondering, since I basically protected your shop. Ah, favor for a favor. Sure. Do you give me a discount? What? I'm so poor, kid. I got no money for a body, no discounts. Oh. I do know a guy who knows a guy. They'll probably give you a job. Is it a pizza place? I've always wanted to try one of those. Is this a Scrubs reference down here? Spot the references. No, man. The pizzas are all gone. Stupid slimes. It's noodle making. Go to Club Street and tell them Apu sent you. If you spot a reference and we don't see it, like, then s comment different references and stuff. Like, I'm pretty sure that's a Scrubs one right here, this guy. Okay. So, we need something to eat. I think we'll grab another cooking kit. It's like most of my money. Hopefully we don't need to pay for the gym. We probably do, but I think I'm going to start work today anyway. Who's this? Oh. Hmm. Interesting. Gym doesn't open till 7, so let's go home and eat. by the time we make breakfast we'll be able to go to work yep nice good start to the farm it's gonna take me an hour to get there Do I pay eight dollars for the bus to get there quickly 
I want to do like a full day. Spend the eight. And go to work. Punching slimes. Beat those slimes. Pop, pop. So every time that completes, I get $29. Nice. I'm losing energy and I'm getting hungry whilst I do it. And I've got to do that much to get a promotion. Oh my god, the whole day went. Come on, you can stop beating the little guys. Time to get some rest. But I'm not tired yet. Good. That's just as it should be. But I'm tired. And actually, I have plans. Get out. Okay. So the day passes very quickly when we do that. The gym closes at 10. Let's get in there. See what it's about. Hello, sir. I heard this was a good place for me to get in shape. That's right, son. Look around you. You've just stepped into the future. At Silver's Gym, we can turn you into a young Arnie if you got the scratch. That sounds like cheating. Come on, it's high technology that makes this city so great. Silver's Gym is a whole new level compared to the junkyard with the lunkhead Russian Mafia. Have you seen their old training gear? Fighting robots? It's embarrassing, am I right? Sounds like an interesting place. With us, you can become a killing machine at the touch of a button. And then test your strength in Silver's Fight League. How do I use the gym? Glad you asked. It's right through there. Don't be shy. Our admin robot will show you everything. Ready to test yourself? To win at the fights? It's literally everything I've ever dreamed of. No more talking. Sign me up. That's the attitude, son. Let's get you on the rolls. Well, well, well. You signing up for the league too? Is this guy messing with me? Why not? I think it's cool. In that case, it shape you die an horrible death. Yeah, he's messing with me. I'm sorry, have we met? I've got better things to do than talk to losers. But remember, if you're destined to cross paths with Lord Uri in the ring, I'll give you a hunk of chunka, such raw power you'll never forget. <laughs> Who's that, sir? That's Huey. About 20 years ago, he was a bandit, worked for Bobo, one of the local criminals. But nowadays, he's got enough GPB to call himself a lord. Maybe the lord of bad manners and weird words. Anyway, I'll put some heart on his lordship. You'll need a lot more GPB if you want to challenge Huey. Teach Huey some manners. There's a fight today, and there's still a free place open. Fighters in the league. I'm at the bottom, but I'm gonna work my way up. Fighters in the league. Eleven angry men and women ready to beat your butt, your face, and other various body parts. Let's see who's in your enemy in today's fight list. <laughs> the ever-changing voice of the paperclip. JD. Your opponent looks like a real tough guy. Let's take a look. Here's his fighting preset. He actually seems a little weak. How did he get in here? Maybe he's just for tutorial purposes. All right, let's sign up for the fight. Usually you need to sign up in advance, but today is an exception. Good call, fighter. I knew you had it in you. Show me what you want. League fights are held on certain days. On those days, there's a period of time where you can end fudge. <laughs> Save that voice for someone later, I think, an actual character. For example, it's between RK and 10. Time remaining written here. Okay. If you don't make your fight in time, it'll be counted as a defeat. Come on. It's fighting time. Punch. Kick. So I think you sort of queue up your thing. I have no defense. No modify. What if I just do 
punch, kick, kick. What happens? Let's see if that burns through all of my energy. Start aggressive. Be aggressive. Be, be aggressive. Uh, kick. Punch, punch. Kick, kick. So then you can choose what you want to do for the next round. So we used up quite a little bit of energy. So if I drop the kick out into restoring energy, actually what we'll do is restore energy here and then punch again. Headshots. Okay, so it's 40-40. We took a, a round off. Throw these kicks back in. Chap, chap. It's getting close. Oh. Yeah. Ah, oh, get him. Oh, one punch all we need. Yeah. Win. Well done, that was a good start. Oh man, even my grandmother fights better than that. <laughs> like her, uh, you'll suffer a tragic end. And gout, I already forgot what my voice is. Don't worry about it. I'm Lord Huey. Take this protein bar, son. It'll help restore your health. Don't forget about the money. We live in a world of victorious capitalism. You already owe me a dollar. For what? Relax, it's a joke. Actually, no, it isn't. Okay, yes, yes, it's a joke. You should see your face. Be seeing you. Hey, that was a good fight. You got some good person points out of it, too. You know how to be a good person. You can unlock a new fight ability with those points. Okay. A defensive ability. Do we want to be a dodger or a blocker? I think I'm going to be a dodger. To the junkyard? We're running out of time a little bit, huh? Whilst I'm here, I should go to the shop, though. Because we're going to need to eat every day. My food's already empties. Okay. I can see, look, you can see people's good person points when you hover over them. Hey, what are you watching me for? Boot, do you have any old tapes? What tapes? I mean, black plastic boxes, people used to watch them, use them for watching movies. Yes, I remember something like that. They're piled up with the rest of the useless junk. If you don't need them. What? Can you give them to me? Certainly, that'll be a hundred dollars, please. You just said they're useless junk. Yes, it was, before you wanted them. Now it's a product. Whatever, I don't need them. I was just gonna throw them in the trash. Who are you trying to fool? Price per tape is a hundred dollars. Well, whilst I'm here, pop on in. Oh my god, the characters from Full Throttle! What? Oh, that's one of my favorite games. I was looking for some spare parts to fix my exercise equipment, and there's a cat. You hear that, Dynamo? We have a customer. I don't like him. Looks like some spying Varanek. Literally, like. Oh my god, it's so exciting. You have no idea what that is. I'm just a simple, hardworking man. Yeah, that could be true. Pay for your parts and leave. Ah, oh, that made my heart so happy to like see these characters here. What? Can I pet the cat? Damn. Don't even think about hitting on me. How can I prove myself to you? What do you think, my Kiska? 
Call me that again and you'll wake up with your head between your knees. Oh yeah, they're supposed to be Russian, aren't they, in this? Okay. Cool. It gives me an idea. But by the way, to prove you're straight and bending things. If you're offering me a job, I'm in. Ooh, let's get to it. Bending for the Mafia. Ah, well, it's a bit late for work. What are you doing here? Oh, I can buy equipment for my home. I think. Okay. Man, the references keep on coming. Do, 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 do. Let's go to my house. Time for sleep and breakfast. We keep working out. Keep pu 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 pumping that iron. Signing in. Oh, if I want to sign in for a fight. Right. And earn points. To fight that guy again. I think I want to focus on training for a minute. Because it wasn't even like a guaranteed win there. Oh, Mosh lashed. Gotta get a bit of a rhythm going. Okay, that took us to half. That would take us full. We also are, like, quite low health. Hang on, that guy said I had an energy bar, too, so rem remember i got to take that. It's in my pocket, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, four in the morning. Silver's gym opens at eight, so we're a little bit off rhythm at the moment. Don't need to go to the shop yet. Gym, the junkyard. Gym at eight. Shop opens very early, so we could go to the shop first. Is the farm... He said eight, right? But I'm wondering if I can work whenever I want. Doesn't say, like, it opens at a certain time, but he did say come back at eight, so I'm thinking I can only work from then. I guess I will go to the shop then. Wait, do I even have any money? No, I have ten dollars. Okay, well, that was just a waste of time. I'll get here for 6.55. Oh wait, do you know what I, oh my God, what I need to be doing is just working out. Completely forgot about the main sort of how we start things off here is just get down on that map. Get stronger. Look, I can do this too. Oh, it's broken. Oh, okay. The mat it is then. Uh. E. Ooh. Ah. Papa needs some money. I'm wondering if... Let's see what working in the... Ah, oh, it's open to the... Okay, I'm just going to do this again. Bah, 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 bah. So we would compare what the jobs pay. Oh. Paid 29, up to 68. That'll do for the day. It's five. So now I want to go to the gym. Don't want to get there too late. And that's actually work out properly. Greetings, valued customer. I'm happy to welcome you to Silver's Gym. This is Minority Report. Here you can easily make yourself stronger, faster, and tougher with our neuro training machines. Um, what's happening over here? This cutting edge technology is your secret to becoming invincible. Told you there'd be butts. Here we have something very useful for after a fight. Dr. Feelgood, our massage therapist. <laughs> Heal yourself here and get back to life. It's absolutely free. Hello there. Remember, I am always available to provide energy, drinks, and food. We recommend transitioning completely to an energy-only diet. What's with the pool? Who's the fat guy? That's our total immersion VR fight trainer for our VIP guests only. Okay. If you have any questions, please ask. 
Okay, cool. Aw, oh, man, I'm loving the vibe of this one, all being futuristic and stuff, and all of these references. So cool. It's obviously like General Grievous, right? Hence the hello there. If you want to get a massage afterwards. A muscle hardening butts. So what, go what happens in here? Ow. Oh. Whoa, you just go in? So in the first game, you could literally go in like an old school gym and like, you know, lift weights and skip rope and you sort of pick what you do. In here, you just go into here. Um, let's do skip rope. Ah, I see. So instead of time, we just spend money and we get like injected with what we're buying. Right, like it just does it. I see. So make me break dance for 12. And you get 120 in that stat. Right, 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 right. Okay. Dr. Fieldgood's services are unavailable. Why? The gym closes at 10. We'll be happy to serve you in the morning. Ah, it seemed like he was putting my health up. Yeah. Alright, gym's closed. Go to the junkyard. Now you were talking about me working here, right? Ends in one hour. Oh, for the fight, yeah. Okay, there goes all my. I'm hungry. So we gotta go home. Spend the five. There you go. Starving to death over here. Ah, oh, I got no food. Bloody hell. Better eat the. Uh, let me save it. Five. Eat the bar. Okay, that gave me a little bit. Let me get a little bit of sleep. So this is... Okay, it's still broken. I guess I better go to the shop then. So this is where it becomes time management. It becomes a bit of a... We gotta scooch around, manage our resources, manage our money, go to work, buy more food. And this is kind of the loop of all of this. Seems like cooking kit is the most valuable. Bang for your buck, I think. Can I talk to him? No. Police station. Oh yeah, I could go work for the police too. What's this? Club Street. Hang on. Other places to visit. Oh, hello. Hello. What would you like to order? Actually, I was told I could get a job here. Who told you that? The man who owns the shop. Brown eyes, nothing below the neck. Ah, you must be friends with a poo. Sure, I could use an extra pair of hands. But if I as much as sniff those Russians on you or that Bobo and Sons, you'll be the one who needs hands. Got it? Sure. Doesn't Bobo have just one son, though? What? Is that what I might be asking if I knew what Bobo and Sons even was? Right, now get to work. <laughs> Feeling Blade Runner down this street. Are we, um, the noodle man? So we can serve noodles? I can eat noodles. It's not time to cook noodles yet. Come back at seven. Ah, so it's an evening job. What about this club? Can I go in here? 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 Frantically clicks. Alright. What else is on the map that I haven't been to yet? Right, let's see what the police want to talk about. About getting a job. No place to take, but I'm... Hollow cop. 
How can I become a police officer? Oh yeah, I need the points, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Tell me more about my father. I didn't really know him, to be honest. At least, not like I knew his father. You knew my grandfather too? That's right, son. When I first joined the department, he was our gold standard. He was a cop too. Not just a cop. He was the best cop this city's ever seen. Wow. It's exactly what we said whenever we saw him. Whoa. Come on, you feel responsible now. Yeah, 2,000 points. Got it. Rules of the fist. Okay, so I can't work there yet. Um, let's go home and eat. What are you doing? Trying to eat something? Do you know what I'm trying to do? Um, to sleep? Yes, I'm trying to sleep. They make so much noise. What am I supposed to do? I don't care, buy some snacks at a shop or something. It was easier eating slime through the dispenser. Maybe some sleeping pills would help. You're not gonna let me eat? Get out, I'm sleeping. Ah, oh, mom. Hungry. Ah, uh, hey, Apu, do you have any pills for heavy sleeping? What do you mean? You take one look at Apu and think this guy sells illegal stuff? No, I don't. Just because I sold my body doesn't mean I sell drugs. I didn't mean that. Read my lips, you little brat. Apu doesn't sell illegal stuff. Okay, I understand. Remember that. And never ask me for anything like that, okay? Okay. There's some sweet candies in that vending machine. Many customers say helps sleep. Do you have a vending machine that sells candies for heavy sleeping? What? Of course not. It isn't my vending machine. I just rent the space rid of my shop. So whose is it? None of your business. Ah, her favorite treats. One candy. Your child will sleep peacefully. Five candies. Enough to quiet a group of men. Ten candies, in case you need to put a violent elephant to sleep for a few months. Ba, 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 da, da, da. Here you go. I was having the best dream, now it's ruined. Scram! Are you actually snoozing? Can't you see I'm sleeping? I see, but you're not sleeping very well. I'm trying. You're making a lot of noise. Maybe these candies will help. Where did you get them? From the vending machine and... I'm not putting anything from a vending machine in my mouth. Actually, our food dispenser is a vending machine with a monthly payment. Didn't you hear what I said? Yeah, but I figured Apu's shop is reliable. They're from Apu's? Technically. Why are you screwing with my head? Give me that candy! Mmm, tastes good. Put them in that dish. <laughs> okay, I'll put them over there. Take them before you go to sleep. Mum? Seems like the candies work. Now I can eat. In peace. Um, okay. Let's sign up for a fight. Gotta work our way up the lead. There's no fight today? Oh. Four. What does that mean? One day before seven? Oh. Uh, let's go work in the junkyard. Oh, okay. That ah, that opens at 8 p.m. Right. Man, this is... I'm still trying to balance this in my brain here. 
Okay, well, I'll go down here. They and they close in the evening, so by the time I get there, I'm going to be able to do a tiny bit of work. I may as well go in the gym. And get one workout in. Deadlift. Let's head like new tech available so I can unlock stuff now. A side punch, a middle kick. Hmm, let's be a puncher. Knock some blocks off. Okay. I sort of don't... By the time I travel down to there, I'm going to need to come back up to start work for the night, so... Working through the night. Pump. Bend. Bending. Ah. Bending through the night. Bending this bloody pipe. With my robo arms like air dock arc. Earning money with my. Hey, Strakunobite, you should go home, get the rest. Uh, robots work here during daytime. But I'm not tired. I said go home. Okay. Let's go. 8 a.m. So I can go straight from there to the gym if I wanted to. Although, the gym's not as exciting as it was before. Like, actually seeing yourself doing the stuff. I feel like I actually want to kit out my home place and not skip with, um, with them doing that. Can I buy stuff off you? What's it going to take to, like, buy my own gym. 150 a piece kind of thing? Yeah. Okay. So we want to save up money for that. Let's go to the shop whilst it's right here. May as well spend the money and save the time because it's close to it. We'll slowly build up from there. Now let's go to our job here and use what little bit of energy and food we have left to punch some slime. Pop, pop, pop. Hopefully we can get one shift in. Stop there, because we won't make another one. And we'll go up to the house. And get some sleep. Night shift, just like back when I used to stream every night. Starting at 10pm to like 4 or 5 in the morning. That was not a good choice. our food back up. I'm glad I don't need to... So during the day it seems like she needs the sleeping pills otherwise I can't cook, right? It's night time we go back to work. So I think whilst I'm doing this I'm also getting stronger, right? I must be. Yeah, I'm getting strength training from this. Finish the shift. That's enough for today. Alright, it's morning. Go to the gym. I want to see if I can sign up for another fight yet. Something popped up there. Yes, okay. So what's that in two days? I'm sure it will remind me. Let's go do our shift down here. Punch some slimes. This is like gym and money. So this gives us footwork. Let's get one more shift in. Perfect. Back home. Home again, home again. Jiggity jig. Put a little food in your tum tum. Ah, I ate it all. God damn it, I was doing so well. <laughs> Sleep. Shop. And 
Oh, I can afford a tape now, but go cooking kit. I want some stuff I can eat right now. The energy bar in my pocket. Another cooking kit. Another cooking kit. May as well spend it. Have it in our pocket. It saves time coming back here every time. Um, let's do a little bit of work because it's right next door. Finish that shift at least. Perfect. What's this? My happiness, is it? Ah, okay. Too hungry to work. So let me just finish this shift out. Eating those. What's my happiness there? I'm curious what I can do for that. So there's Mafia, Yakuza, and Bobo's gang to work up rep with. I don't see anything about my happiness. Pushing noodles. Okay. Right next door, spend the money now. Bye bye. Now, home, and eat. Oh, so she's sleeping now. Now, that candy was only for one day. Is she going to be annoyed? Yeah, okay. Okay. So, daytime, I can't eat here. That's an obstacle. I have to keep her in those snacks. So, see how much work I can get done on this empty tummy. New buff, low rage. Oh, I'm just too hungry to finish. Because I'm not working out, working out maybe. Okay, she's watching her shows now. Let's see, does doing training make my rage go up? Hmm. I wonder how I raise that. The rage stat. Work makes it go down. The gym's closed. I'll work through the night, and then maybe I'll go to the gym, maybe that's gonna help it go up? Or maybe it's fighting, it's like I need to fight. Yeah, I bet that's what it is. What happens if it hits zero? Probably don't want to find out. It's past time. I hopefully have the fight today, I think. I got $45. Let's have a cup, an energy bar in my pocket, just for those emergencies. Gym's at eight. Go home real quick. She's still watching that. Have a little dinner. Fill up the candy bowl. Fight! Available now. Perfect. So let's see now if our theory holds true. It's time to fight. I've been training, sir. Fight day. And I have a defense now, so I've got to dodge in there. Bang, bang, bang. Getting stronger. Rocky theme starts blaring out. Love those movies. Who's this guy a reference to? Because he's kind of got like a Kano eye and then he's got like the Ma Marty McFly orange jacket. So I'm not entirely sure. Bam. Hollow cop. Good fight, huh? Yeah, thanks. 
Victory is no cause to relax. Just more reason to work even harder. I read that in a magazine that someone left in... Never mind. You know, I was watching you fight, and I caught myself thinking, I like the way you move. <laughs> Sir, if you're trying to hit on me... It's working. No, I mean, I feel like I've seen those moves before. A good friend of mine moved the same way. That was a long time ago. 20 years now. You were probably just a baby. That isn't his picture hanging on the wall by any chance. We could have starred in the Twin Sitters. Holy smokes. How didn't I recognize this right away? The resemblance is uncanny. Are you... A clone of my old friend? No. It looks like he's just my father. Oh, yeah, that's what I was thinking, too. I wouldn't even know where to begin. He's been gone for so long. But if there's any reliable source of information in this city, it's the digital archives in Upper City. It's all the information we've been collecting since the creation of the universe. They've got everything, even that video with Pam and Tommy. If there's anything you can find out about your father, it's there. Nice. Only people with a 9,000 GPP are allowed to enter there. The path is long and painful, and it begins in the Silver Fight League. He was strong. Some say the strongest. We were friends. Best friends, you could say. And we were constantly getting into different funny situations. Lots of funny stories, you could say. Could you tell me one of them? Of course. Just let me remember the funniest one. Remember anything? Cut me some slack, son. You won't remember a damn thing at my age. Oh, maybe I should have this voice then. Hello! Right, it's eight, which means it's time for work. Stomp, 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 stompy, stompy, stomp. <clears throat> Finish that shift. Let's get one more in. Time goes so fast when doing this one. Two shifts. Get the money. Head home for a snack. Replenish. Oh, I need to eat. I mean, sleep. Sleeping through the night. Feels good, man. Do a little bit on my training mat. Sign in front of the fight. Did I miss sign-in time? It literally just popped up whilst I was doing that. What? Or do I have to go there to do it? Signing in ends in one hour. Oh my gosh. What? I can't even go there though. What, what do we... Um, what happened? Must have missed it. Uh, uh. Oh, wait. Training mat was like unhappy. I'm unhappy or the training mat's unhappy? Oh. Okay, good to do a full day. A full day of work. Slime punching at night. Come back tomorrow. I should have walked. Bloody hell. Can we waste some time. What can I buy from you? The double bobo. Extra thick. Extra thick. Um, I guess I'll just. <sighs> like, is there not a pass time option? Just let me go in. It's 15 minutes, dude. I spent money to get there and then ended up just having to walk <laughs> home and walk back again. God's sake. Uh, need the money though. Punch, a punch, punch, punch. Mm, 4 p.m. Let's do one more round. So each one of these basically pays for a meal. So we need to do at least oh, two to make a 
profit, basically. Up to the house. Mum's up, so we need to quickly if I have some food. Okay, out of food, so then we'll go to the shop, and then we'll go there, and I'm gonna rotate this through, and then we'll advance. Look, I've just noticed it's Jay and Silent Bob outside from the Kevin Smith movies. There's references everywhere. Like, I'm definitely missing some as well. And like, Happy Cheeks, this is um, Demolition Man. He doesn't know how to use the seashells. I guess this is like toilet paper in the future, just like in the film. Gotta just like scan all the art now. Um, right, why was I in here getting some stuff? Ooh, I have a promotion. Hey, slime puncher. Yes? There's this guy. He doesn't like your work. Uh, why? He says he punches slimes better than you. Uh, is it a competition? Sort of. I'd love to see you prove him wrong. If you can beat him, you get his job. Get to it. Get a promotion. <gasps> In a fight? Dodge to dodge to dodge 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 to dodge to dodge. Let's do punch kick rest dodge dodge. Okay, for the first round. Oh, we're fighting here as well. Okay. Oh. Well, I'm not getting the promotion, am I? Bloody hell! All right, we gotta step it up. The thing is, is I was resting a lot and my energy still went. I think he was maybe doing attacks that took my energy out. Oh my god, side punch. I haven't used my new punch yet. Open up with side punch. Okay, direct approach is always best. Deals more damage than punch. Good. And then... A kick and a punch. Sweep, sweep the leg. All right, that's getting us back in there a little bit. No. Come on. Oh, he's blocking. If we just side punch, side punch, side punch. Let's see what that does. Because it's strong, right? Gonna be close. Damn, I think. Oh, dodge. Oh my gosh. Okay, just hit those side punches. Come on, dude. Don't lose your first fight. Yes. Yes. Let's go. I was not expecting the win there. You did good. Enjoy the promotion. Todd, hope you enjoy being fired. You've proven yourself worthy of joining our fighting school. Ooh. What school is that? It's called Arpkido. All very secret, focused on stamina and fortitude. Endure to the moment when the enemy runs out of health. Keep your muscles toned to use it to its fullest. Okay, I get it. Thank you. Fighting style based on good stamina and solid blocks. You've unlocked a new fighting school. <laughs> Here are your fighting schools. Arkido. So it is a Dune reference, like like Arrakis, I'm guessing. I don't know. Let me know in a comment. New perks. Activate them. And new tech trees. The low kick. Okay. Path of the angry tortoise. Enjoy the new skills. I'll do my best.
Um, ah, and because it's a blocking school, I'm going to have to learn blocking, aren't I? So I have to spend good person points to learn stuff. Ah, but I'm trying to, like, grow my good person points, aren't I? Hmm. Let's get the low kick as well, then. Deals more damage than kick for the same energy cost. All right. Um, back to work. I should have looked at... Ah, oh, yeah, I do. I get an extra $4. I got a bit more for that promotion. Good. Just about finished that shift. That's what we want. Now, go to bed. Looking pretty tired there. Yeah, Mum? I'm so weak today. There must be a geomagnetic storm brewing. Oh. I hate to ask, but since you're going out anyway, bring me something to help with this headache. Of course, Mum, no problem. I'll get some head medicine at Apu's shop. Get medicine. I need to have some food first. Let's get all the way to... F it takes so long to eat. Oh my god, it's 9.30 now and I need sleep. Signing in for the next fight. Available now. Hello? Hey, hey, hey. How's my favorite fighter? I don't think I've seen him around. Tough, but modest. I like you, pal. You're climbing up that tournament ladder like it's a... Like a... I like a ladder, but an easy ladder for kids. Uh, thanks. After this next fight, I'm going to need you to lose it. Um, why? Uh, the guy you're fighting, he's kind of a big deal. He's got a lot of GPP. Just forfeit this one, okay? I'll make it up to you. Um, no. Well, I can't decide that for you, kid, but trust me, it's best for everybody if you lose. Forfeit a fight? No way. I'm not taking a dive. I ain't throwing nothing. I wish the gym was just 24-7. It's so annoying trying to balance that in. Um, because I want to go there and get my health up. With, uh, General Grievous there. Let me... Go do a little midnight shift. In the... Yard. Can we get a shift done? Yes. A booze. Medicine. Hello, Apu. Greetings. Sure do. You should be careful not to overtrain yourself, then. Oh, it's not for me. It's for my mum. She's a bit under the weather today. How unfortunate. Well, here's your medicine, and please give this to your mum, too. My treat. Apu's present for mum. Okay. What are you giving to my mum? Yeah, that's some candy whilst I'm here. Also, whilst I'm here, get some food, actually, because I just had the last one. Da, 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 da. There we go. Man, I need to make more money. I'm just forever broke. Okay, let's go to home. Present on sleeping. All right. Well, gotta work then. I guess you just gotta keep working and working and working until you get those promotions and earn more money. Really? Seems to be the way. No punching slimes past eight. Ma. Ma. 
The cat's looking at me weird. Mom, I'm back. Oh, back already. Did you get what I asked for? Sure did. The shop owner also added a little present to cheer you up. Oh, how sweet of him. It's my favorite kind of chocolate. You know what? I'm feeling better already. Wait, really? Be sure to thank that nice man next time you go to the store. Okay. Unless I should thank him myself. This conversation is officially too awkward to continue. Food. Food. Midnight. Sleep. Work out. Two days till the fight. Let's do it. Let's get that next level on weight training here. Red's not going up too much. Feel that burn. Feel that pump. Come on. Keep going. Keep going, soldier. I'm pretty sure that's what people say to themselves in the gym, right? Yeah, come on, soldier. Uh, keep it going. Uh. Okay, we're worn out. Was that all my food? Okay. One, two. Nice. Buckle my shoe. One day till the fight. And I need a bit of sleep. After all that working out. Me after a casual walk. Oh, I should have a little nap. Me after a meal, actually. Alright, max energy, apparently. Which means I must have some sort of thing going on with me. Let me go to the gym. And get healed up by the old bot in there. I'm glad you don't yes have to pay for you had to pay for entry to the gym before. There we go, he's healing me. So I've got these like debuffs on me, and I don't know how to get rid of them. Let's see. Low rage, so I need to like keep fighting to get my rage up. And that's costing me stuff. Does it say how I fix it? I don't think it's given us any information on what rage is or means. To be honest with you. Alright, warm up. And deadlift. A strong. Fresh. Break dance. Break dance again. Got it up to three, and we're good to go. So I'm full health. Time to go back and eat and all that stuff. Wait, I needed to buy more food, didn't I? Oh my gosh. Is there a worse feeling? Fridge empty. I'm still up. Sit in the old armchair. What? Hang on a second. I can sit in the chair and watch TV. What does it do? Plus for heart. Ah, so if I want to recover health, I can just sit in the chair. The sleeping recover stuff. Hang on. Other than energy. It's just that debuff, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, it's fight day. Uh-oh. we got a fight coming up. In three, two, one. Let's do it. I ain't taking no dive. All right. I'ma box you up, fam. I'ma box you up, fam. Step in this ring with me. You get a box in the eye. You get a box in the ear. You get a kick in the shin, bruv. I sweep the leg. I see a leg on a punk, I sweep it, trust me. Still. <laughs> Round two, innit? Learn these moves on road. <laughs> trust fam. Listen. I'ma smack the mohawk off it. What? Why did you trip me up? What? I mean, oh, don't trip me up, bruv. 
Um, how are we doing? 43. Ooh, low energy. Low energy. Take a break. Take a break. Take a break. There we go. Keep blocking. Block, block. Blockity block, block. And kick block. Let's pretend I know what I'm doing. Okay, it's fine. It's working for us so far. Oh, no. Get up. Get up, your bum. Ah. Shoot. I mean, I meant to do that. Hey, I meant to throw the fight, sir. Honest. Like you told me to, boss. I knew you wouldn't let me down, kid. Hope that rich idiot's happy with the outcome. Here's your reward. 100 bucks. I mean, I tried to win, to be honest. Da -da -dee -dee -dee. So what else do we have still? Get a tape. I love this. This is such a that's a cool little feature because you're always wondering, you're like, what can I do next? What's the next thing to unlock? So any sort of feature like that is awesome. Alright, let's go home and rest. After we got our butt whooped. Like, yeah, I meant to lose, sure. Let's actually go try working at the noodle bar. Let's see what that pays. Whoa, look at this place at night time. Oh my god, it is a Blade Runner reference. Deckard's sitting there. It's a long, cold movie. Just like every night in this dark, hopeless city. Did you say something? Wasn't talking to you, kid. Pretty sure you were. You got the wrong guy. Just leave the guy alone. The ex-cop likes to drink sometimes. He should have been better. So now you are talking to me, right? Serve and protect, they said. You were... a cop? That was my profession. Ex-cop. Ex-detective. Ex-killer. Sounds awesome. What happened? Difficult to say, honestly. I don't remember. Memory problems, huh? Cops always have a partner. Maybe your partner remembers. Don't have one anymore. He died? Worse. He's a hollow cop. I was arrested by a hollow cop once. Are you bragging? No. Piece of advice. If you want to survive this rotten place. Learn to lie. Don't trust anyone or anything. Even your eyes. Okie dokie. But why is a hologram worse than being dead? Holograms are like any other machine. A benefit or a hazard. If they're a benefit, it's not a problem. You're talking about free will. I said everything I wanted to. Okay. Ooh, like unlocked a new sort of so hang on. I can go in here? <gasps> the club opens at night. Oh my god. I can just jam out. How cool. Ah, oh, kill Bill, go go your barries in here. This piece of iron on a chain is called Lun Chui. I'm pretending I know how to pronounce that. Cool. Yakuza boss deputy nightclub manager. And is this like sub -Z wearing the Sub Zero like outfit behind here? Don't distract me while I'm working. So wait, what can I do in here? Can I dance or something? That's back out onto the street. Oh, we're so going to have something to do here later, aren't we? Dance floor's empty. Get some more people in there. Alright, working in the noodle bar. K. This is like... It's almost like they thought, you know, we'll fill this with so many references that it just becomes to the point where no one can sue us. Alright. Noodles. So what does cooking noodles get us, I wonder? The blue one. Signing in for the 
next fight. Hang on. I want to sign in for the fight. Do I have to go there to do it, maybe? Close anyway. Yeah. Flip and serve those noodles until the morning comes. Okay. Seven in the morning. Sixty-four dollars in the pocket. We're all the way over here. So, so let's go <laughs> to the shop. Takes us to eight a.m. Buy some food and carry on. Ah, we have a promotion in the bending. Little guy, I want to tell you something. Yes? You've been good bender. We're thinking about giving you promotion. Sweet. Don't get too excited. A true bender doesn't just bend the pipes. He can also bend his enemies in half. What if I don't really have any enemies? Oh, no problem. Sugi! You are enemy now. Have fun. Ba, 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 da. Street fight in a way. In all these different locations that look so awesome as well. This is like a Terminator reference back here. Down into the lava. Um, let's take a little break off in the middle. There you go. Energy's quite low. Manage it a bit more. Should be winning this one. Easy. Easy. Lemon. Squeezy. On a mass. Punch. Hey, shook and fight. Your promotion. Get the bend more. It better bend up. Oh, yeah, school, fighting school. Samba. <clears throat> Brute force and trick moves. Oh. Try that in our next fight, won't we? Oh, whilst I'm here, let me just... Uh, my energy's pretty low, but... Do a little bit more. Getting $36 a shift. Hey man, little Bubba, I think we know each other well enough by now for me to let you in on my secrets. Come by the abandoned house at night, I've got something interesting to show you. <sighs> Meet little Bobo at an abandoned house. Come along, come alone, make sure you don't have a tail. Why would he think I'd have a tail? That's exactly the joke I was about to make. Ah, oh, so basic. So, a nighttime rendezvous with the old Lil Bobo. Let's get a full belly. It's 6 p.m. now. If I just do this for 30 minutes, we should be able to go meet him. What? What? There we go. Abandoned house. Ah, wants me to go there at 10, not just nighttime. Keep working out then. Pump. Pump, 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 pump it up. Ba -da -ba 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 -ba. There we go. What's going on? You come alone? Um, yeah. No tail. Not since I was born. Good. There's something I thought you should know. In my spare time, I work as a hacker. <gasps> Sounds awesome. I know. So I can hack the GPP system for you for a modest fee. Can't we go to jail for that? We could. But we won't. We'll do it all nice and smooth. How? I can increase the amount of GPP you get for winning each league fight. How much? The bigger the difference between opponents' GPPs, the bigger the reward. What do I need to do? The 
plan is as simple as a Steven Seagal script. Sign up for a league fight, find me here, pay for my services, go to your fight. If you win, you get bonus GP. <sighs> You're never made you yawn, you have to hit like and comment. Like Bobo says, when he has a good dream, profit. What do you think? 20 bucks, I mean, sure. By the way, you already installed some software onto your chip. Installed what? The best part of having a chip is the software. Easy boosters. For what? Some software is for work, some just makes life easier. Lots of people around the city, lots of them can install software for you. I can install my best program for you. What does it do? Send you notifications so you don't forget to hack your next fight. How much does it cost? For you, man, totally free. Sure. Reminds you about available League Fight hacks. I agree to the terms of the license agreement. I want to get helpful notifications. I put my GPP at Lil Bobo's disposal. Consider the previous checkbox active. Oh my gosh. Congratulations, you'll see the difference. I guarantee it. Oh, I hope it's not annoying. Wait, what else is in here? Any references to anything here? Hmm. There's a piano. What's that, the pianist or something? What's the hat on the table? Not sure. It? Stranger Things? Not seeing too much in here. Anyway. On with the show. A fight. Dear minor character, welcome to Demise. Sincerely, Lord Huey. Can't remember what the voice was. It's been so long. Your cap buckled too tight, Mr. Lord, sir. Yeah. Yeah. You want some? Have some of this. My fighting style is unmatched, Lord. Huey. I'm not even going to call you Lord. You're just Huey. And you can hold the L from Lord Le Huey. Good opening round. Time to teach him a lesson. Keep it going. Got some good energy, doing some good damage. Big, strong fighting school. Hit him. Oh, he's making a bit of a comeback, isn't he? Okay, he had that round. Let's throw in a little kick. Go all out here. Use all your energy. See if you can get back on top. No rests. No rest modules. Just punch, punch, punch. Okay. Oh yeah, his energy's low too. Knock him down. Yes! Good job. Okay, now we need to take some rests because we're quite low on energy. So we're going to punch, rest, punch, rest. Yes. Yes. There you go. Wonderful. Wait. I know that. I've punched face. I've punched that four. Where some guy beat the crap out of me at a poo shop 20 years ago. You're not just some extra sucker. You're Dark Fist. I'm who? How's it even possible? Oh. Wait. Congratulations. It's high time someone taught him a lesson. So wait, my dad is Dark Fist? Silver, I need to talk to him. Don't worry, you'll see him again. We'll like him never stay gone for long. It's not my fault, Dad. Yeah, you're always getting distracted with your stupid device. Uh, okay, Bubba. If it's not your fault, then who's? One of those slime punches. What happened? Our tech genius managed to flush hundreds of dollars down the toilet. He means a few of the younger slimes escaped into the sewers. Oh, I can go find them. Really? What do you expect to get for cleaning up little Bobo's mess? A promotion? 
fine. Bring them back in one piece. Find slime in the sewers. <gasps> New location. The sewers. They all lie. They all fear. They all hurt others. GPP is a lie. There is no upper city. <gasps> now, if there's ever somewhere to be an it reference, it would be in a sewer, perhaps, right? I'm going to be a red balloon somewhere. Airpods. What? Delight for your right ear. <laughs> what? Before I forget as well, let me unlock some new stuff. Um... Reduce enemy dodge chance with a faint. Ba, ba, ba. Ooh. So what are we proficient in? My stats. We're pretty strong. And the footwork. So yeah, let's keep going along here. leads us to the path of the lazy bear. It's perfect for us. It's perfect. Okay. Uh, okay, so I need nine to get to the next one. Doesn't depend on strength. Consumes a lot of energy. Increases chance of blocking. Consumes more energy. Like a standard kick, but consumes less. Weightlifting gives you more leg power. Increased movement speed around the city. Allows you to carry more items in inventory. Let's have increased movement speed. Around the city. That's a good idea. Hello. Quite creepy here. Pizza box. The good old days of pizza. I'm pretty sure you delivered pizza in the first one. Hmm. Long old sewers. What's this? One of those. Pop, pop, pop. I always thought in the Jackie Chan movie, Rumble in the Bronx uses one of those, and I thought it was the coolest thing. The cons. That's a reference to something. Is that... I get that it Khan, and it looks a bit like Shao Khan from Mortal Kombat, but I feel like the cons as a biker gang is actually a reference to something as well. Maybe it's more full throttle references. The cons. I don't know. Let me know. It's like 2 a.m. so my brain's not fully on it. Mum would kill me if I brought this home. Is that a predator mask? <gasps> halt. Who goes there at this hour of the week? I'm just looking for some slimes this hour of the week. The only slime here is you, trying to sneak into resistance territory. Is this why you're dressed like a tin man? I'm a man immune to the toxic Wi-Fi of the outside world. How could Wi-Fi... Be? Never mind. I'm sure you haven't seen any slug-looking things? Size of a shoebox? Green? No. No. The resistance will never go green. Prepare to fight, trespasser. Size that snake. Winky Tinky. Okay. Ooh, throw in a faint. He's got quite a lot of health. Looks 
like we've unlocked the next story beat if we beat it. Oh my gosh, no, he's whooping us. Oh dear. Um, pick it up a little bit. We open with an uppercut. We hit a side punch. We rest. Come in with a low kick. Throw a dodge, couple of dodges in. Change it up. Getting hit too much. Come on, me. Get him. I'm doing anything. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Oh no. Looks like we're going down. as a vegan. Leave here and never return. Oh, so I've got to get better and beat that guy. Time for another promotion. Hi, Grisha. I wanted to talk to you about... Yeah, yeah. You seem grim. I mean, more than usual. What's up? Ben Grimm is that character's actual name in Full Throttle. You see, coming in, metal industry is tough. To survive needs to be tougher, but tiresome to be always this way. If only there were some long forgotten form of entertainment that would melt our iron hearts. Hmm. Henry is a great entertainer. He amused me for years whilst I was stuck at home. I think I have an idea. Help me. Help! Okay, so we've got to go see our friend. Let me finish my shift. Is it my favourite neighbour? Or do I owe the pleasure? There's a problem I think only you can solve. I'm all ears, mate. The co-workers from the factory seem to be down lately. I need something to cheer them up. You talking about those Russian guys? Yes. Ah oh, man, I had the perfect tape for this situation. Just got it last week in the mail. It was during that crazy rainstorm. Really? I don't remember the last time I saw it rain in this neighbourhood. The wind blew so hard the package flew out my hands. That doesn't seem likely. It got washed away down into the... Yeah, yeah, I'll be in the sewers. Ah, so the tape is in the sewers. Hmm. Why is all of the promotions down there? Guess I'm gonna have to find it. A little bit of energy. Hit him again! Oh, we won by decision with three health left on him. Got through it nice. I had my doubts, but it really is you. Huh? My name is Casey, kid, and I knew your father, Steven Seagal. What was he like? He was a fighter. The Yeah, yeah, the greatest one there was. Can anybody tell me one other thing about him? I think there is someone, yeah. We can't discuss it here. Meet me at Mick's house. Come alone. Hello, kid. This is the sergeant from the police. Um, sorry, I'm going through a tunnel right now. It's... Kid, I can see you doing the thing with your mouth. Uh, I'm using the bathroom right now. Can you wait? So it's a tunnel with a bathroom? Uh, yeah, it's super convenient during rush hour. Kid, are you up to something illegal? Uh, no, sir. I promise I'll flush. No, you're just making it weird. I'm calling about the impressive progress you've made in the league. Uh, thanks. I'm confident you'll get your GPP score up soon enough. Being a policeman's about more than that. How good are you with the laws? 
You know what they say, mum's word is the law. Who says that? My mum. Cute or creepy, I can't decide. You know what, let's check your legal knowledge. Sure. How many GPP to get into Upper City? Over 9,000. What's the penalty for GPP hacking? Losing all your GPP? Oh, it's the death penalty. If you do want to wear the badge, come to the police station. The police need recruits like you, but you have to put in some effort, okay? Alrighty, there, see, all legal. I'm not even going to ask. Okay, we need to speak to him still about that thing with Kay anyway, don't we? Mix old house. Okay, so like growing up, I loved old Steven Seagal movies. <laughs> I used to borrow them from my dad's friend to watch. That was when I first introduced, but like ones that people have never even heard of, not even like Under Siege and stuff, just really like old ones. But I just, I loved martial arts movies so much, like all the Jackie Chan ones as well. Love Jackie Chan. Um, let's go there now. Let's see what's happening. <laughs> Do you know what this place is? No idea. It used to be Mick's house. He was your father's coach. If anyone ever really knew your father, it was him. Great, where can I find him? He's dead, kid. Oh, sorry. You can bring him back to life. There's actually a crazy scientist you can find in a lab around here. Wow, he had enough GPP to be digitalized? What? Mixed consciousness was saved by a hacker. Isn't the good corporation... Ah, uh, so you've already been brainwashed. The corporation doesn't care, kid. This place right here used to stand for something. Now it's just a wreck. Maybe someone will restore it to its former glory someday. That'd be cool. If only there was a young and capable fellow around. Are we about to rebuild this gym? Yeah. Some spare time on his hands. That would help. A burning desire to learn more about the guy who used to live here. If only there was such a guy. I meant you, kid. Oh, I got that right away. GPP will make you happy, kid. Mick will tell you the same. Just visit the sewers. Wait, what's in the sewers? We are all clowns. Oh, wait. I am renovating. Look at me go. Oh, and I get old school uh, points by doing this. Awesome. I'm wondering if this is a really obscure Matrix reference from when they're in the walls. Because it looks just like that when they're sort of climbing up the pipes and they come through. Hi. What are the crash tests for? This looks familiar like it's from something. These mannequins like that. Uh, we need to eat. Let's go home. Hopefully now we're tough enough to beat that guy in the sewer. Now that we have beaten the... League. The big guy. I would think they're strong enough for the sewer. But let's make sure we're all rested. And ready to go. So have a nice long sleep. Do you like martial arts movies? And what's your favourite? If you have one. <gasps> Did you order 15 yoga mats? Yeah, that was me. Some of them got lost. Oh dear, how many? 14-ish. Three quarters. You mean you lost all of them? How is that even possible? Well, it wasn't as hard as you might think. Is this a Death Stranding reference? I'm filing a complaint. Sure thing, I'll be happy to deliver that for you. You're getting a spinal twist. Hold your horses, Yoga Mum. I got a Delavamatic de de immunity. See you next time. Anyone ready to start a fight? 
Oh boy, am I ready? Get over here, cow face. Do all yoga positions sound like insults? Fight the angry woman. Um, so I need to train more because I'm running out of the little tonus points that let me do this big kick, but we'll open with two of them in the first round. And we'll see. I have a lot more health, so I should be okay. But maybe she's like crazy. Let's see. Okay. Kicking my head off, that's for sure. Take a rest there. Leave that kick in for now. And we'll just do some dodging. Trying not to focus too much on dodging and blocking because it looks like the part of the lazy bear is like no box. It's just fighting. And I feel like we have to do the bear, surely. Oh, okay. That's an issue. See, I start falling down once I start blocking because it uses that energy, doesn't it? Oh, no. It's turning around. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh dear, oh dear. Right, stop with that. Just punch, man. Aggression. Aggression. Oh, we're gonna lose. Yep. All that health and you can get the job done. That's why you don't mess with Ruth, baby. I'm just gonna lie down for a sec. I think we need more stamina to keep up with her. Alright, let's go check this lab out. Oh, and also let's go to the police station, too. Hello, are you a mad scientist? Well, I don't know about scientist, but I'm certainly mad. Or is it the other way around, Glodas? You are 100% correct, boss. Good bot. Now, what do you want? Actually, I really need your help. This is a broken hard drive with a very important mind on it. Can you restore it? Marty! Uh, um, yes, yes, it can be done, but it's gonna be... What's the word, goddess? The opposite of easy peasy lemon squeezy. Right, sorry, I just learned the concept of idioms. Ignorance is bliss, but knowledge is power. Some spare parts for this to work. You can ask them at the Robo Factory junkyard. Hey! The moose! Parting is such sweet sorrow. And uh, Glodas being Gladys, I would think. Portal games. Welcome. You're here to study police laws. Yeah. Let's begin. This is your police cadet desk. Oh. The course is divided into five chapters. Take them one by one. Each one is more difficult than the last. I'm no guy who makes funny sounds with his mouth. No idea what you mean. You may begin whenever you're ready. Police Academy. You know the Police Academy? Come on, I love those films. Ah, so I have to like actually come here and study law. And I get good person points when I study here. Interesting. How cool. And I have to finish all those chapters. Let's see if we can get chapter one done. You finished your first chapter. Now you know why we need GPP. Helps us keep track of who's good. Make life easier for them. That system is what makes our city so successful. Yeah, I literally just read that. Great. Keep up the good work. What if there was a game where when you had to study, it made you actually study and answer questions? Or even if it could voice detect and you had to actually read out loud, like some sort of study book. I feel like no one would play it, but it would be an interesting kind of experiment, wouldn't it? <laughs> We're actually going to make you learn. You're going to learn in this game. Man, I have been oh, all over the place here trying to up my fighting. It's definitely been a grind. Like, you're seeing this now. There's been a lot of 
cut play just me rotating through sleeping and working and trying to get stronger trying to get money never seem to get out of the like poverty line here of um earning just enough to eat and sleep and train it's like such a grind actually right so we're in pretty good shape here it's 2 p.m got all my stats up i'm not burnt out um we've got one day till the fight We've leveled up a couple of things. Let's see if we have any tech to unlock. Not sure. But it might be time for another another try in the sewer, maybe? Unlock these. Increased chance of blocking consume more energy. I don't know. Bum, bum, bum. Do you know what we'll do, actually? We'll go to the gym. Until it's time for work. Fix this place up a little bit. Get that first promotion, and then we'll work through the night. Because we're a little low on cash and food. Ah, cool. Opened up, like, cleaned that area by working in here. Nice. really cool. Okay, I got a bit distracted and worked through the night a little bit there. Which means I can unlock this. So now I'm more efficient when working, which should be helpful. May as well work through this night here, actually. Alright, so I've got to fight a robot in order to get the spare parts to train their fighting bot at the scrapyard. They well, they'll give me the spare parts so I can bring back Mick. His digitized consciousness. Going well so far. Oh, man. This, like, no block unrelenting damage is working for us. I just wish it would get us through the fight league, too. If I get my energy up that we can just do that, I think we'll be okay. It wasn't half bad, here's putts. Nice. Emmet. Emmet! Just remember her shouting that in Back to the Future 3. Glodas, please place an order for a new quantum accelerator. Unfortunately, there's not enough money in your account. Not enough money? I built this economy, for God's sake. But my pension covered at least that. This month's pension was taxed even further. At the present time, you have enough for... a cup of coffee. Damage! But not a cheap one. A nice one, with, like, cream and sugar. That's enough. And a nice frothy bit on top. I got it! And marshmallows. Jeez! Hey, kid, come here. Yes. You want to make a quick buck? Sure. I have some weaponized body augmentations. You need to deliver them to the bridge. And illegally sell them to some police officers. Yes, yes. Illegal. As in, I get some money, you get some money, and everybody's happy. Okay. Here, I've got the parts. Great. Scotland's national animal is a unicorn. Oh, it's only gotten worse. Spewing random facts like some kind of wikibot. Should I come back later, or...? Hand me the parts. Okay, move this here and combine it with that. Pop that in there. Moving in together and combining your stuff is the perfect opportunity to connect with each other's tastes and styles. Okay, done. What's the password? The what? People are three times more likely to use their pet's name as a password than a family member's name. If you don't know the password, you better go find out. Casey might know. Okay. Problems are only opportunities in work clothes. Henry Kaiser. Alright. Sell some stuff at the bridge. Hello, officer. 
This is a restricted area, son. State your business immediately. I was sent by Emmett. Who? The... The quirky scientist? What for? I have something for you? Son, you trying to get us mixed up in bribery or an illegal transaction? Yes. Well, you should have said so. Come on, give us the goods. I feel like testing this out. Come over here, son. I'd rather not. All right, then you have the right to remain silent. Uh, okay, sure, let's go. <laughs> Yo, he has like 190 health. What the hell? I'm about to get whooped. Come on, kid. Oh, we're hitting pretty hard. He's not blocking much, so we're kind of holding our own, but you got to keep landing those hits. Surprisingly neck and neck after he started with way more health than us. Throw an extra kick in. Just do three of those kicks, honestly. We need to, like, overwhelming power here. Use all of your points. Kick, kick, kick. And get him back training. Yes, there you go. Get him, buddy. Hit those kicks again. Hit the kicks. Oh, it's close. But now I have... Ah, oh, I have no points left for it. Okay. Hit him. Come on. Come on. Yes. Wow, we actually won. So surprised. These are really good. Thanks for bringing them. Here's your money. Hey, it's money. All right. Let's go see where that leads us. God, I hope we get a good payday. Hello. There's no time for hello. Did you get my money? Here. A hundred dollars. Finally! Order it! Hello, human fellow. It's a burden to be as smart as Emmett. You are in a superland. Spinners and yo yos? We've plenty of those too. Have useful software and several augmentation modules. Twelve little words too hard for you. Well, you've probably already seen augmentations on people in the city. Implants, cybernetic eyes, mind enhancers, big super powerful iron hands. Ah, like Major Jackson Prex from Cortal Mombat. Do you want the same sort of thing? Holy smokes, you can do that. Piece of cake. It'll cost you, but I have two huge things lying around here. It's going to be the best day of my life. Take off your t-shirt now, a couple of signatures, and we can start. Uh-huh. Let's start by cutting off both your hands. Uh, wait, what? Don't worry, you can pick them up later. They're fun to play around with. Like those Vietnamese kids from Apocalypse Today. But after a week, I still recommend throwing them out. Organic matter and all. Uh, I never saw Apocalypse Today. Second, no way in hell I'm letting you cut off my hands. The augmentation rules are clear and simple. If you want to attach something, first you have to cut something off. By the way, this also applies to the lollipop area, in case you were wondering. I wasn't. Just thought I should mention it. Uh, getting yourself some huge bionic super arms or not? I don't have any money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly what all the daredevils say. Um, so what's he going to offer us software-wise? Okay. My favourite one, lol kek. <laughs> what does it do? It sends you a joke once a day. Some of them are just so, so, but some are hilarious. Uh, tell the one we got today. If there's a little Bobo and there's a Bobo, then what's the name of Bobo's father? Grand Bobo. See, just hilarious. And it's free? No way, what kind of word is that? Free? It's a meaningless concept. Some charge an installation fee, others charge a daily fee. Be careful, some programs are completely incompatible with each other. Okay, get to the programs, old man. Lolkek. If you want to get a joke today, a workout booster. 
neuro training becomes less effective. Oh. Improves old school training. Bus pass. Having your own vehicle but not yours to keep. The price for riding the bus drops a bit. Earn extra strength from training and other stats suffer. So if I wanted to focus on a specific training. Okay. Hmm. Maybe I'll do that when I focus on stamina, honestly. Neuro training less effective. So I guess when I'm studying, then I would have to take that out. Can I try the bus pass one? Price of riding a bus drops a bit, like... I don't... It's a dollar a day. Okay. I agree to be well behaved until I get fed up. I agree to not share my pass with anyone, at least not for free. We'll try that out. See how much it reduces it by. Wow, we really need to go to sleep. And then he walks home. Doesn't even ride the bus. What an idiot. Let's try this guy again. Come on. I've worked out. I've picked up my energy. I've got strength. Surely. Oh my god. This guy is like... He attacks a lot. Maybe I do need to dodge more. Come on. Okay, we're kind of winning. Let's throw a little... Dodge in. Oh, okay, so we need to drop that out. An energy one, a dodge. Okay. Let's try that. Come on. Keep it going. Want that tape. Want that promotion. Okay, keep that going. That seems to be going well. He's only at 37, 33. Our energy is good. We could probably throw another punch in here on the next round if we need to. If it goes that far. Yep, okay. Let's go all out. We go uppercut, uppercut, side punch. And then we're going to throw a little shovel hook in there. Yes! Yes! We actually beat one of the resistance! Perfect. I hate to bother you. I'm just looking for a... Tape. Great. There you go. This will liven things up a bit. What's it? What did bring? It's a tape of Brother 2. Well, I haven't seen that movie since I was a little kid. It's classic. Where did you get this tape? Actually, a very weird story. Is your story more interesting than Brother 2? Um, I doubt it. Let's go watch. Consider yourself raised or whatever. Yeah. The promotion. <clears throat> I'm tired and hungry. <laughs> My poor little guy. The adult world isn't so easy, is it? Yes, Mum. Sometimes you have to get over your pride. Yes, Mum. You shouldn't judge people for their actions till you know the whole story. Yes, Mum. You're such a lovely boy. Mum gave me a sandwich. Do you trust your mum enough to eat this? Uh, save first. I don't trust mum. Okay. Eat the sandwich, I guess. Let's see what happens. We're okay. Hmm. I have no food in the fridge either. Um. I need to work. Don't I? I need to work today. Eat the other sandwich that I have. A little bit of sleep. And then that should take us to evening. Oh, a little bit more sleep. Our first promoted work. So we should be earning nicely now here. It was already paying quite well. $40 a time. Nice. This should help a lot. Great. <gasps> and one box of seashells. 
That'll be five dollars, sir. Thank you. Have a nice day. Hi, Apu. I'm... Did someone just yell, don't move? This is a robbery? No, what? No? Well, then how incredibly lucky you are that I am here to protect you. I am... Wait a minute. You're the obnoxious guy that I built at Silver League. Huey, right? Like Lord Huey or whatever? What? No. I'm the superhero this city has been longing for. I am... The most darkest fifth ever. I don't care at all. What? You scared? <laughs> Run away, Robocop lollipop. The earth is round. We'll meet again. Well, now you just crossed a line. What did you just say about the earth? I said it's round. Listen here, Mr. Most Dumbest Brain Ever. Have you ever heard about the Bedford Level Experiment? Or maybe you've just seen the planet from the cosmos with your own eyes. No, I didn't think so. All they ever do is build random theories based on fake photos and alleged astronauts, obediently parroting the nonsense they teach you in school. You should do something. Or they might kill each other. Hey, dude, you shouldn't let this guy bug you. This isn't the sort of thing to get worked up about. What? Did you just say I'm wrong? What's wrong with people's hearing today? Actually, no, I'm just saying... In that case, prepare to face the might of the resistance! Ah. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, God. I've got to fight resistance fighters non-stop. Again. These guys are tough. Ding, ding. Okay, so I really need to save some stamina here as well. Oh, actually, it looks like this guy might be blocking. I should check. It's a dodge. Okay, we might be okay. Now I just gotta conserve energy. Is he blocking? He's dodging. Okay, so we do the faint and we'll conserve energy. This round, we can serve energy and just throw in some side punches. Oh my gosh. Doesn't work too well, does it? You gotta throw something. Come on, mate. Bloody hell. Uppercut in there. Okay, put some blocks going. Come on, he's at 25. Just finish the job. 17. Oh my god, nine. Come on! <gasps> oh god, all out. Gotta go all out. You got to. Jeez. Please. Please! Yes. That was close. You might have beaten me, but you'll never beat the truth. The hell do you think you're doing? Is that how you say thank you in jerkies? I just helped you. I don't remember asking for your help. Why do you think everything always revolved around you? You're exactly like him. But now I'm the main hero. I'm the most darkest fifth ever. Okay, super dude. Not a chance. Now you'll taste my wrath. Seriously? Oh my god. Huey. What are we doing here? Okay, so you're a block and a dodge. So we do uppercut, break, side punch. Oh. Okay. Yep. Um, let's go ahead and blow through our energy and see what, where it gets us. Big round. Big attack round. Not having the desired effect. Now my energy's really low. Need to go back to taking a little break. Okay, so he's only blocking, so we drop the faint. And we only use a penetrating attack. 
and he's doing side punches. Maybe I'll throw a little dodge in. Change it up a little bit. Okay, round three nearly over and it's neck and neck. Okay, now he's blocking and dodging. Don't have the stuff to do that. I'm going to stop defense because it's burning up energy. Come on. Come on. Don't let him beat you. You beat this guy already. One more. Let's go. What a disaster. The fourth is the evil of the path my power with yet again. But don't worry. The most darkest fist ever never surrenders. And always comes back. See you later, my underappreciative public. Maybe it wouldn't be so bad if they, you know, had killed each other. You never know. Yeah. Let's get some food. That's all I came in here for. Get my life back on track. Stronger. I'm so surprised that I beat her. This is officially the worst day ever. Sorry for your loss. Piss off, bird dog. Are we gonna kiss right now? Uh, where are we on the rankings? Up there to Mad Chad, getting up there, and Mad Matt, Mad Morph, gotta overcome. <laughs> so many Mads. What the hell? Just uh. Ah, ready to shake things up a bit? You're not fooling me. Last time it took me a while to recover. I never saw a wild animal feeling sorry for itself. Bring it, mister. Ah, okay. Well, my energy is really low. I was not ready. Are we going to bond through fighting and grow a healthy respect and maybe even a love for each other? Is that what's about to happen? Totally, if it was a movie, they would end up at some point, you know, falling to the floor together and being like, <laughs> oh. <laughs> Helping, like, take each other's gloves off, like, unwrapping the bindings around the wrist and, like, peel the gloves off, like, oh, okay, I'm holding hands right now. Oh, my energy below. Better take some breaks here. And also, I don't have any points for the kicks. Close. Might just about get it. Might get knocked out. Okay. Here you go. Ah, oh, you did a lot better that time. I try not to make the same mistake twice. Case in point, don't stroke the cat the wrong way. Now I can see you're a nice guy. Maybe you'd like to come to my fitness classes? Honestly, my life couldn't get any busier right now. My mum has kept me locked up for the last 20 years. And my father mysteriously disappeared after winning the coolest tournament ever. I'm trying to figure out a lot of stuff right now. I get it. Looks like Ruth will be teaching alone again. Fitness isn't so popular around here. Oh. These lazy slumps would rather do neuro training than good old-fashioned fitness. Maybe they're shy of doing it together. What should I do? I can't train everyone individually. What if you could? How? I was watching some old movies with my friend Henry, and Agent Smith never got tired of dying, no matter how many times me and Henry watched the tape. Are you saying I could record my classes on video? Sure. Thanks for the idea. You're welcome. Thanks for the sparring match, buddy. I love you. So, what was that? I mean, good, good luck. Uh, bye. <laughs> um... Oof, we need sleep. That was a big old session in there. Greetings. Damn, it's that smarty pants guy again. I noticed you're not so bad in the ring. Besides, who cares how many classes you've passed, right? Is that a compliment? 
If you like, but let me get to the point. I would like to apologize for my behavior at our last meeting. I should have suggested that you were stupid. Really? After all, I can't imagine what made you turn out this way. There it is. Maybe when you were a baby, your mum dropped you from the 18th floor. Or she just left you in front of the TV for six years, showing reruns of Sabrina the Teenage Witch. That is cruel. Maybe you're just meant to be an intellectually disabled gardener, still waiting for his Dr. Lawrence Angelo. <laughs> or is that reference too obscure for you? Sorry, anyway. I'd like to invite you to the nightclub to celebrate your latest victory, to smooth over any hard feelings about our first meeting. What do you say? Well, great. I knew you were a quick-witted fellow. Maybe not very smart, but quick-witted. I'll be waiting in the club. I know this sort of thing is important for people like you. Ah, now the nightclub. We get to go. We'll go there tonight. So, I got a new videotape. Let's go watch it with Henry. Saved up. If tape. Hey, mate, your videotape. Oh, is this the only one Apu had? No, he has more. Why don't you bring the rest? Apu's kind of a cunning man. I see. Nothing written on the tape. Wonder what movie's on it. I don't know. I hope it's something worth watching. Only one way to find out. I stand there awkwardly watching it. Sit down, boys. Stony. A stubborn and gifted boxer sacrifices everything. Stony. Instead of Rocky. That's hilarious. What did we unlock? Stony arms. Increase the effectiveness of barbell training. Increase effectiveness of treadmill and punching ball training. That's funny. Good stuff. Definitely. Your nose is broken. How does it look? It's an improvement. <laughs> Find another tape. I know what to do. Great. So now I can unlock these from the Stony movie with my old school points that I've been earning doing up the gym. So there's oh, so many more movies to watch if you get them. But the next one's $200. So, I'm going to have to earn some more money somehow, if that's what's going to be going on. Let's go home. I want to see what I have in the fridge. Whether I need to do any working or not. Okay, we've got two of those. Should be okay. Let me have a little lunch. I'll do a little bit of a workout here. energy up and I think I might go down into the sewer again uh, let's do the nightclub actually sorry let's do the nightclub whilst we're on that story beat oh my not quite friend don't be shy come am I sure I want to do this meet my friend Plato hi evening we were just discussing one of his ideas. Plato, tell him. It's about the illusion of everyday perception. Okay. Imagine a cave. A bonfire is burning in the cave. Plato's cave. And all the people inside are standing around the bonfire with their backs to it. What do you think they see? Uh, can we order a couple of shots? They see the reflections of the flames. Oh, uh, yeah, exactly. Then, will they be able to understand what they see? Will they be able to understand what fire is? If all they ever saw was dancing shadows on the walls. Of course they can. There's something cooking their backsides. Anyway, main question is, if you take these people and turn them to face the fire and tell them this is a fire, won't their eyes hurt? Won't they argue that this isn't the fire, but the reflections on the walls that they saw before? Transcendental. I'm sorry, but what does everyday perception have to do with this? Okay, here's a simpler question. What's warm, useless, and no one has ever seen? Don't know what? Your brain. Sorry? Seriously, where did you find this guy? On the shelf with half-finished products? Can I... Here's a mysterious thing you might have heard of. Rectangular with a little symbol inside. It's called a book. 
Are you trying to say I'm stupid? <laughs> Boom. Best joke of the night. In that case... I'm gonna die a laugh, duh. Fine. Let's see how much you laugh when we meet in the ring. Beat Aesop's face. Can I talk to our guy here yet? No. You can work here eventually, somehow, it seems. Like, there's a, a working point there, but... Um... Oh, there we go. Da -da 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 -da. I mean, whilst I'm here... Put a shift in. And... Let's get to here for the night. Get some moolah. With my Russians. The Russian mafia. I want to get the promotion with them. I feel like I need to, to unlock more strength. Because I seem to be capped for some reason. And I'm really not sure why. So. That's something that we need to keep doing. Let's head home. And eat. Let's get Mix House going. Wax on, wax off. We're getting there with this one, look. We're getting it refurbed up. Three, two, go. Will this be the last one? Almost. It's going to be a gym, isn't it? I love this. Fucking all night. Painting the walls. Picking stuff up. And feeling my... Get that motion. Punch Club. Be better. We're opening the Punch Club. all done. I guess now I just need mech, don't I? Something to open the gym. Oh yeah, I'm still trying to find Casey. Where the hell did he go? Now that I've done this place up, you would think he would show up. Hmm. Well, let's eat and stuff again. Imagine, like, get a bed. She's kept you in here for 20 years, sleeping in that cot. Awful. Okay, so I just want to fight, and he told me to speak to this guy about fixing these next equipments. Excuse me. Hey, don't you dare touch my zipper, you wretches. Oh, who the heck are you? Ah, uh, just a client. I thought you were one of the naughty ones who ran around here. You didn't mess with my jungle trying to pull my pants off. You seen anyone? What do you want? Uh, he looked kind of like Mario. I don't know. I'd like to train on that thing you're fixing. Is there anything I could do to help? You look like a strong... Oh, now it's Russian. Forget it. You look like a strong guy. Maybe you could. What? Bend the unbendable. In fact, I'm just about done, except for one missing piece. What's that? A Klein bottle. We need to find someone who can bend it into shape. Looks complicated. Oh, we need a bending master. The junkyard. Okay. Hey, mamma mia. Okay, so I'll go there tonight. Let's go to the shop and get some food. I'm so I'm so sorry for the accents. Okay, I'm oh, sorry. Okay, we'll sort ourselves out and rest till tonight, and then we'll go ask him. So, let's eat first. Fill that up with the lunch, too. Snooze till night time. God, that looks so uncomfortable. Oh, we got the drink over. What's the um, taxi cab reference to? 
it like the fifth element car? What is that? I'm gonna ask about it. You've come to the right place, but everything in the world can be bit. Oh. No, it's impossible. Don't even ask. What's wrong? In my country, we call this a figliushka. It means thing that cannot possibly be. I wish you good luck bending that thing. The mysterious figliushka. Isn't there anyone who can help? Mm, maybe Spoon Boy. <laughs> Spoon Boy? Ah, oh, Spoon Boy. Look for him on the bridge. <laughs> Under the bridge. No, the never normal person could do anything with this. I will never want to feel like I did that day. Take me to the place I love. Take me all the way, Spoon Boy. Spoon Boy. Let's finish our shift. Getting close to the promotion here, and I'll be a master bender myself, I have to say. Two left to do. Get in, put, 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 paid. Let's go under the bridge. Under the bridge. Oh, <laughs> it's the Matrix reference. Spoon boy. There is no spoon. He's gonna bend it. That makes so much sense. Stay, buddy. Me? Yeah, you. You look like a sporty fellow. You interested in trying something to help you become stronger? What, steroids? Let me guess, a flyer garrick concoction that berserkers used to drink before battle? Neither, but the second idea is so bad. I don't have to ask my supply about that. I'm talking about boosters. you will temporarily increase your stats. Are you interested? What's it cost? Oh, the price is very affordable. I know quantities are limited. You see, to make one of these potions that takes a little day, I don't just sail over here on this on me. So? Oh, you can only buy one of these drink bar and I And then you leave a new delivery. <laughs> where did you get them? <laughs> Let's put it this way. You don't ask me where I get my stuff. <laughs> my boys. I can't do this for long. Don't ask who you're going to be <laughs> with it. Sound good. Judging from the on my hand. And that raft over there. A detective might have guessed the goods are from somewhere. On the other side of the river. Yeah, isn't that dangerous? <laughs> isn't that dangerous to get in fights every day? Everything we do carries risk to some degree. The key is having a good sense of proportion. You ready to buy some illegal stuff or what? Sure. So, strength boosters and... Hmm, okay. For two days, I'll have boosted strength if I need to beat someone. Spoon boy. Maybe so. Or maybe not. Well, you're obviously a boy. And there are obviously several spoons here. What do you want? Can you bend this for me? I asked Brigadier about it, but he said it was impossible. It is. Then how? Do not try to bend the thing. Instead, only try to realize the truth. What truth? That you owe me 50 bucks. You tricky little... Take your spare part. It's done. <laughs> Thank you. Bye. Be careful with the machine it's attached to. Huh? It'll take a powerful healer to recover from the side effects, which can lead to... Powerful healer. Like my grandpa. Did you say something, grandson? Nothing. Exactly. Far better to say just a little bit than to say too much. What's in here? Only the worthy may pass. Do you think you're worthy, son? Yeah. What? Is it that makes a person truly worthy? That's right. A worthy person is useful to others. When you have something useful for us, you'll be worthy. Like what? Like... 
Like AirPods. Like AirPods. Like AirPods. Like AirPods. Like AirPods. AirPods would be good. I have one AirPod. Here's your AirPods. You know, God made people the same. We all have one mouth, one nose, two eyes, and two ears. I can't understand my meaning. I only have one AirPod. So I gotta find the other AirPod. What's this? Happy Cheeks shells. Lost seashell. Civilian, I need more information about you. Do you copy? I'm here. What do you want to know? What's the real reason you're fighting in the leagues? I want to find my father. Has he been gone for long? Before I was born. I've never even seen him. Sorry to hear that. Maybe it's foolish, but I'm sure I can still find him. Sometimes I feel like I don't have Under the bridge, of course. Lonely as I am, together we cry. Oh, it's the Breaking Bad van. Mr. Heisenberg, are you there? No answer. Ah. Cool. Okay. We need food and sleepish. All right, we got the part. I brought the missing part. Let's take a look. It's exactly what we need. <laughs> Looks like the machine will work now. Okay, almost safe. Maybe I can squeeze a little more out of this baby. I wonder how much better this is going to be. Extreme Neuro Trainer. Opening ca 400 on a what? Shopping run. Wow. That is a lot. Oh. Brain overload. For the next 12 hours. Slight brain overload for minus three rage for a day, minus 10% neuro training effectiveness. That was some good uh, training, though. Skip rope. I'm just very confused as to why my strength is locked at 11. But this has gone up to 13. Like, that can't be the maximum, can it? Um, it's gonna work. Let's get this promotion. Should be able to do that this night. Two rounds left. And then max up this promotion. And this is the strength job, so maybe this school's gonna unlock some more strength than me. I'm not sure. Great. It's gonna cost how much? You have me, bud. I mean, I'm sure you have a ton of other options, right? Hey, Bender, handle delivery for me. What's the reward? Uh, promotion. I'm in. Take these implants, deliver to the bridge. Junior officer is cousin Godmother's son-in-law. I promise I'll look out for him. I promise who? I promised it to... Promised. Someone in the chain of relatives. Okay, to the bridge. And this promotion. The bridge is closed, apparently. And then we'll go home and eat. Things are starting to roll now. Let me tell you, things are really starting to roll for you now, kid. You're on top of the world. I'm wondering if the Silver League is the end. I feel like not. I remember the first game being quite long, so I feel like we're not even into it yet. That would be my thought, but we'll see. When is the bridge open? Night time. Oh, well, seven to seven. Okay. Um, let's finish this then. Mix place. Oh wait, I have finished this, but nothing's happening yet. So I think I need them. Okay. I feel like Casey's got to be in the sewer, isn't he? 
And the dream lab was something in the sewer, wasn't it? Let me see. What do we have here? I'm getting a bit confused. We have beat Aesop, take implant to the bridge, find slimes in sewer, talk to the hollow sergeant. Ah, about that. About K, yeah. Customer service. Okay, so that's with the promotion. Find Casey, yep. Study city law, win silver league, get GP. What was with the scientist? Where's my science mate? There, okay. Ah, find Casey is the next one with that. Okay. Wondering where he could be, but let's go study up some police law, I guess. Gotta move that forward too. And speak to you about your friend. Back so soon. I'm afraid you don't have enough GPP to be an officer yet. I was wondering what it's like to be a holocop. Well, son, it's great. I can serve the great corporation and help people even beyond my untimely demise. Why do you ask? I met a guy. Who? He didn't say his name. Long coat, lots of frustration, hates holocops. Ah, sounds like Kay. I haven't seen him for so long. How is he? Moping. No wonder. We used to be partners. What happened? Let's just say in this line of work, you either crack the case or you become the case. Kay took my death hard. But you're back now, sort of. Kay may have mentioned the accident. It was ugly. We both did. Some things we may regret. <clears throat> we both tried to forget. Kay managed that part better than me. We've never talked to each other since. The short version is Kay thinks us holocops are controlled memories. Tools, not people. Yeah. Before that, everything was fine. We ate donuts with raspberry jam together. You know what? Maybe you can help change Kay's mind. Hmm. This is his police badge. It would be meaningless for you, but Kay has a lot of memories associated with it. Give it to him, as proof I want to make peace. The Holocaust dream of electric sheep. Alright, we'll study law till they're open. Da -da 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 -da. May as well finish this chapter, eh? Kay's usually there till 7. Finish the second chapter. Boy, you good at scanning letters with your eyes. Great to know you. Know now how you to gain GPP, like by winning in a league, for example. God, I don't know I can read that. You lose it if you get defeated or break the law. Are you repeating everything I read? Am I repeating it? Yes. Or am I? Okay. Zip up here. Give him the badge. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, in the red corner. Great, this guy managed to get himself loaded. Towering and terrifying, The Undertaker. It's an old TV show. Sorry, my father. You know wrestling. Two big guys with makeup beating each other for fun. Not interested. More about real fighting. You have more in common with wrestlers than you think. How's that? You follow the script that was written for you. It's someone else that decides when it's time for you to lie down. And you will lie down. No doubt about that. As a wise man once said, life sucks, then you die. Or something worse. By the way, what's even worse? You were the sergeant's partner, weren't you? Before the accident. I'm not talking about it. Come on, Kay, he misses you. Listen, kid, this city isn't what it used to be. How can I say it so you'll understand? It's the toughest, meanest boxer you've ever met disguised as your lovely mom. Um... Just waiting for you to bend over for some of her delicious pie. 
and then kick you in the balls so hard, nothing will ever be right again. I know this is hard for you. That's why the sergeant gave me this badge. I don't really know what it means, to be honest. Or why it keeps beeping like a spy bug. But he said you'd understand. He wants you to know he remembers. He still cares. You're hopeless, you know that kid. I'll tell you why it's beeping like a spy bug. Because it's a spy bug. Holy smokes. And thanks to you, now they know exactly where I am. Could you do me a favor? Of course. Throw that thing in the trash where it belongs. Forget we ever met. Isn't that two favors? And one more thing. Don't believe anything. Or anyone. Not even me. Wait a minute. Does that girl have three tits? What? Where? <laughs> Damn. He just said not to believe him. How could I fall for that? That's a Total Recall reference. Well. Off he goes. I wonder if that's the end of that story, or if it... Yeah, it is. Doesn't continue on from there. Cool. Hopefully. Unless things take a real turn. We've got enough energy. Just gotta land some of these shots. We might get through to the resistance. Maybe Casey's in here. Come on. Come on. Keep it going. I'm not gonna do what I did last time and overextend, but I am gonna switch to that big kick. Come on. Hit him with it. Nice. Ah, oh, finally. That was a hard one. Okay, okay. Maybe it wouldn't do any harm to sort out the trash. A short but odiferous time later, our sewer diving hero finds out... Oh. Slimes. Slimes for Bobo. That was it? There's no, like, secret hideout and other characters down here? It was literally just get to the slimes? Oh, man. <laughs> oh, wait. There's fast traveling in here. These weapons everywhere. A shrine. And another way over. What? There's a box. Hang on. Ah, Casey. Casey, this place is a maze. What the? What am I even looking at? Well, my plan was to go underground. I guess the plan worked, even if somewhat literally. Say hello to Bill, by the way. Hello? How do you do? Yeah, he's an elderly mutated assassin crocodile. It's the whole thing. Casey, this isn't a social call. Sure, what do you need? I restored Mick's device. Congratulations, kid. It has a password. Is it Punch Club? You tell me. Well, if it isn't, just add a two at the end. Wait to turn it on back at his place. You'll have enough explaining to do, as it is, without a talking crocodile. No offense, Bill. No, I'm Titan! Activate Mick. We haven't had pizza in so long. Once upon a time, one of them was man. <laughs> I can play video games down here and it restores my health. How cool. What else you got down here? Anything? That would have been some chicken. They gave me alligator, but... What was this box? The AirPods. Nice. Alright, let's get out of here. I don't even want to know where those other tunnels go, to be honest with you. Is this the exit? Worry about them another time. Papa gotta get home. Actually, we could do with going to the gym and resting, but... I'll go home for now, since the gym ain't quite open. Oh, oh, oh.
boy, am I starving. Ready to go for a pizza right now. Um, Mick? Sorry to tell you this. Pizzas don't exist anymore. Who the heck are you supposed to be? I'm the guy who saved you. Your body died, but your mind is now a... Cut me some slack, kid. I'm a transparent old man floating above the ground. Obviously, I'm a ghost. You're a hologram. Holo what? I'm dead. I'm not dumb. There's no such thing as ghosts. Boo. Your mixed memory stored on a hard drive. I'm a phantom, striking fear into the hearts of my enemies. <laughs> Fine, you're a ghost. Are we in my gym? Where are all my beautiful trophies? It's not half bad compared to what we started with. I mean, I did what I could. I guess we could get up and run it with some new equipment. I never figured out the password to your office. Punch Club 2. Before we continue, can you clarify something for me? Sure. Don't panic, but... You're aware that phrase usually has the opposite effect. I think you've been cursed. What? I see a glowing number above your head. Don't worry, I know a good witch. Mick, that's my GPP rating. The heck is that? Good person points. The more you have, the better a person you are. How do you get them? Winning league fights, I guess. So the only way to better yourself is to beat somebody up. Um, wait, do you really know a witch? Of course, how else do you get rid of warts? How did my gym get ruined? Probably abandoned. Nobody took it over? Don't people need a gym? It's not like you left it to anyone. There was a guy. Looked a lot like you, in fact. We went missing. Right, that was my father. I should have mentioned that sooner. Well, small world. Sorry, kid. About your father disappearing, I mean. Oh, yeah, I am kind of sad about the gym, too. You mentioned some kind of league. Silver has one in his gym. Right. Anything under the table. Huh? You know, on the quiet side. Like, quiet fights? Jeez, kid, I mean illegal. No idea. Hmm. What's this Silver's Gym nonsense? Neurotraining systems, VR training, massages. No, Training? You get into a capsule, you watch training dreams? What a load of bull. Training means sweating it out with dangerous heavy stuff. I have some of my dad's old equipment. Scratch that, let's buy something new. The stuff you're picturing, they probably don't even make it anymore. I'm sure we could find some stuff at the junkyard. Does that sound illegal enough? People throw out good equipment and go to dream gyms instead. What a future. I've been thinking. Silver's gym's all fancy and expensive, right? Sure is. What if we start a cheaper one with old school equipment? Perfect for kids from poorer families. Great. They can compete in the leagues and become good persons too. Or is it good people? GPP stupid kid. Beating up a lot of people doesn't make you a better person. What does? Friendship. Helping out. Being useful to society. How do you measure that? That's not the point, kid. I guess we could make something up. Like, old school respect. Sounds catchy. Let's get this new gym of yours up and running. Yeah, let's open a gym! Cool. Place hasn't changed a bit, except for all the dust. You'll be living here? Living? I'm a ghost, kid. I think I'm supposed to haunt in ya. Oh. That's enough, Mick. You're not a ghost. How come I can sense the afterlife? The afterlife? Describe it for me. Everybody hates each other. There's way too much nudity. Everybody remembers anything for more than a minute. Nobody does, I mean. That's not the afterlife, Mick. It's the internet. Ah, it explains all the ads. <laughs> Back to the question, are you gonna stay here? You tell me, without a body I can't make heads or tails of this future you got me into. Maybe some kind of hollow device. 
I should ask Emmett. Yeah, 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 yeah. Anything I can do in here? No. Emmett. Emmett, can I ask you a favor? Sorry, can't. I'm busy making a hollow body for Mick. Uh, that's what I was going to ask you about. Wait, what day is it? Obviously, a day too early. Stupid time traveler. Wait, you can time travel? Doesn't that make you an omnipotent god that can effortlessly solve any problem? He uses it exclusively to eat out-of-date yogurt. First rule of time travel. And we're probably never mentioning it again. What was I supposed to ask him? In exchange for the whole advice. To deliver some GPP chips to the nightclub manager. Oh yes, go do that. Since you're already making the device, what's the point? Kid, if you annoy me, I can literally turn you into yogurt. Got it. Dee -dee 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 -dee. All right, but let's get our health back up first. We need to have a little rub down from the general, you know? There we go. And we should be good from there. By the time we get there, will it be will it be nighttime? I think it's like past 7 p.m. Um, check in at the shop to see what food I have in my fridge. I need to do a work day. Okay, I've still got three foods in my fridge. Let's go back and eat first. Whilst Mama's watching the TV, and then we'll head to the club. Getting there for 9:30. Give chips. Can I see the manager? Of course. We at the nightclub value any and all criticism. Guards! Wait, what? I don't have any criticism. Emmett sent me. Ah, okay. You can give the goods to me. You're the manager? Got it. I'll be leaving. Bum, ba, da, dum, bum, boing. All right, let's do a bit of work. We broke. Broke is a joke with one dollar to my name. Dun, 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 dun. Wait, aren't I fully promoted now? Oh, deliver the implants to the bridge. Oh, I forgot, let me go do that right now. There he is. You're under arrest, pal. What, why? Illicit delivery activities. Is there law about making deliveries? Sure, to protect the public from brutes like you who steal our hard-earned jobs. No doubt I'm busy. Just send another idiot. Are you the manager or what? This isn't a delivery. I just bought a present for you from Grisha. A present, huh? Let's see. They aren't for you. Are you going to start something over it? If I have to, I will. Oh, I've got to beat the place again. And I don't have any points for big kicks. Well, what are you doing? Break through, drop guard, and crowd the enemy. Slightly increased damage received. So I probably don't need to have a modifier attached because you're not doing anything. Well, see what happens. I'll let you know I hit pretty hard, sir. <laughs> Get the wind kicked out of you. Man, we are holding our own, but he hits pretty hard. Drop one of these. I have one point for a kick. We need to in the next round. We'll drop it in. Nearly the end of round two. Come on, fight back. Yes. Okay, if I drop the kick in, we might get this. Come 
Come on. Get that kick. Yes. Judge Dread. Okay, okay. You're right. You can deliver your implants. You're just gonna let him... That's not how this works. Thanks. You haven't seen the last of me. You'll never be a delivery boy. I'm Sam. Now if I go back to the junkyard. Promotion, baby. I delivered the goods. Glade, here for promotion. I'm the best bender. I get 44. I'm a hundred reputation with the mafia. And I get an hundred dollar bonus now every time I fill it up rather than a promotion. I would have liked some more money, to be honest. Forty-four dollars per shift. Like I'm trying to live here, dude. Gotta eat. Man's gotta eat, you know. Okay, fridge is nice and full. Onward. Yeah, 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 you did it. Please, you never mind. Here's your device. Bye bye. Sorry, it's almost yogurt time. I feel like the robot would definitely say yogurt. <clears throat> hey, Mick, I got the device. You sure it's gonna work? I'm gonna have a different voice now. I almost got turned into yogurt for it. It better work. Okay, let's try it. Actually, I like this voice better. I just gotta make it in a way that I won't. They'll, like, tear my throat up. I guess it does work, huh? Alright, on to the next phase. We got everything we need to open a gym. Except for one tiny thing. What's that? A trainer, kid. Aren't you a trainer? Let's get our friend to do it. Ruth, whatever her name was. Maybe we can open a dating agency, too. This sad and lonely hermit will find you the love of your dreams. Get rich, scream. Scheme. This panel is old. Okay, I get it. What do you want me to do about it? I want you to be the trainer. Become a trainer. You got what it takes. Yeah. Great. Except. Except what? Can't we just do this already? You don't seem like much of a trainer. Why do you get my hopes up just to crush them? Calm down, drama queen. Unlike me, you're alive. I mean, unless this is all just a simulation and we're all just batteries inside the robots or something. You were saying? Oh yeah, build up some street cred. How? Become a champion in that silver league. That makes sense. I'll go do that now. Simple as that, eh? Alexa, calm down. Alright, so I've got to win the league to open my gym. Perfect. Let's buy another tape. The last one will cost 399. Let's go watch it. New tape. Hey Henry, I found a new tape. Cool, wanna check it out? Sure. Let's do it. What's this one gonna be? What else would you do? Terminator? Alien? Oh, Starship Slimers? Oh, Starship Troopers. Great film. In the new millennium, deadly danger hangs over our planet. Hordes of giant slimes from a distant system gather, threatening all of humanity. Can we survive? Have fun, that's an order. Entertainment restores more. Train like your life depends on it. Tonus fills up faster. Pain is in your mind. Less heart consumed in a fight. The only good slime is a dead slime. Do you think that sounds rude? Yeah, maybe. A little xenophobic. Sure. I mean, why didn't they even try and negotiate? Slime can't talk. They didn't even ask. So we can unlock that stuff. We should have a bunch of old school points. Wait, where's the old school hiding there? Wait, there's like three more schools to unlock. Oh my god. 
get all of those. He said the last movie, but there's so many more old school things here. Okay. Let's go back and sort ourselves out. A well-earned meal. There's nothing better than a meal that you kind of like get to treat yourself or to reward yourself or to like celebrate something. You're like, this is for me, for that thing that I did or went through. It's like, ah, oh, it's the best feeling. Everything tastes so good. It's very satisfying. Is that just me? Like, I treat myself with food. Depends. What, what's your treat, I should ask, actually, if it's not food? What do you reward yourself with? If you succeed at something, you win something, you achieve something, beat something, persevere through something, what is it that you then go, right, let me reward myself here with blank. Let me know in a comment what your reward of choice is. You know, maybe you reward yourself with a skydiving trip or you go paintballing or something, I don't know. There's lots of options, isn't there? What do you do? I'd love to know. Maybe you buy yourself something. Retail therapy, that's a good one. Sometimes I'll buy myself a new gaming soundtrack final. Um, seven. Let's keep going. I kind of want to get another videotape from my work. Since we bothered to level up completely here. in the next fight, baby. So he said it was 400, so we're halfway there. I found the other one, didn't I, in the sewer? So we have both? There is a story about dogs and a fat hare. Once some dogs saw a fat hare and ran after him. And they caught him and killed him. It was very cruel. There was a lot of blood. The moral is, the hare was fat. His parameters would not allow him to escape. You can change that. For the right price, of course. You begin to grasp the essence of things. Ah. To shift from the language of poetry to the profane. Unlike the poor hare, you can redistribute your stats. For example, take your strength points and invest them in agility. An important clarification, you only put points in the tonus of agility, not agility itself. This can be useful if a sickly boy gets himself too pumped up at the gym and becomes overweight. Right. ba ba bing ba ba bing ba ba bing ba ba bing bing ba ba So it's what you want to turn into Tonus for something? I mean, I don't need to do that. Here's your AirPods. Oh, now I see you are worthy. Are you happy now? He can't hear you anymore. His entire being is focused on listening to Biggie's Ready to Die. Those were great times. Get in the hole. Oh, it's a shortcut. It's just a shortcut to the sewer. Like, okay. Thanks, old man. <sighs> Thanks for nothing. So I need to ask her for a wrench to fix the neuro machines. I did have one till some rusty skunk stole my toolbox. Who would need all these tools? How did it happen? I was messing with my motorcycle and suddenly some old bucket of bolts crawled right out the pile of garbage. Said he'd like to restore his fallen comrades and enslaved world. He grabbed my toolbox and ran off towards the robo factory, dirty old vermin. If I sort the guy out for you, will you let me have a wrench? Sure, just kick all the bolts out of him and bring me back toolbox. So what, he went in there? Isn't this the Robo Factory? Oh, there's the Robo Factory. A new place. Hey sexy mama, you ready to kill all the people? 
Excuse me? Damn, another human. I hate you. I thought you were a robot. I thought you were a robot and a pretty one too. One that could stand by my side as we witness the destruction of mankind. You have big plans for tonight, don't you? How dare you. You mock me. You won't be laughing when I use the power of this wrench to restore my fallen comrades and... Yeah, yeah, yeah. And enslave the world. We've heard it before. Are you implying I'm banal, you squishy piece of meat? I'm saying I have other plans for that wrench. Okay, they're blocking, so we do penetrating. But I don't have any kicks. So we'll just do uppercuts. To begin with. Break on through to the other side of your block. Okay, doing well. Let's throw in another punch at the end because we're keeping our stamina pretty well. Step it up a little bit whilst we're in the lead. Imagine fighting a robot. I mean, scary. You can't, it literally can't hurt them. It's punching metal. Champ. Damn it, how can one small human foil the plans of an all-powerful robot? <laughs> Flex. Ugh. Okay, fine, take your toolbox. Remember, the time will come that mankind will kiss my shiny butt. The time will come. Tell me I'm pretty again. Alright, let's take it back to... Slidey. Great. Hope you made that rush the schmuck suffer. If it's suffering when nobody kisses your butt, then yeah. What? Nothing. How about that wrench? Might as well do some work whilst I'm here. And then in the morning we head to the gym. Give the guy the wrench. Go, Mario. The nuts are tightened. Thank heavens. Ah, lovely, small, shiny, useful, reliable, solid. Sweet iron smell. Nice fit to the hand. Never thought someone could love a wrench so much. Now you try out this baby's extra powerful mode. Are you sure you got a friendly healer on call in case of side effects? Extra powerful mode. Uh, ah, I need to, like, have eaten to do those. Okay. I mean, while I'm here, let me buy a couple of snacks and get it done. I think I even have some in my pocket, to be honest. Nope, I didn't. So, I did need to buy those. Let's do breath training. Wow. Halfway. Getting my brain fried. Two days till the fight. Alright, time to fight the second placed person in the league. They're going to do lots of dodging, so we faint. They're going to be really attacking quite heavily this round. But I believe in me. We are strong. You've beaten one robot. You can beat another one. Ow. 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 Got it back a little bit at the end there. Let's throw in one of our super kicks. So what I realized is the reason my strength hasn't been going up is because I'm always throwing this super kick. When that's not maxed out, when that's not at full, you don't gain any more in that discipline. So my strength has been stuck for quite a while because I keep throwing these kicks to win fights. So I need to strength train after I do these and deplete them. 
to then get it back up. But it's just such a good move. So just one guy above us, right? Aesop. To win the league. Let's do it. Okay, so we've leveled up our strength, which means I can, before we go to that fight, unlock the lazy bear. The path of the lazy bear. Hit seldom but hard. Don't use defense, just attack. Make the enemy fear your strength. Okay. Path of the lazy bear. Wow, and it's opened up a whole other school. I see. Wow, so many moves. My gosh. Path of the bear. But I'm not 15 strength yet, but I am 15 on these, so it's like... I know that's all of my points, but I feel like I should do that in this fight. It's against the top guy. Peasant, you finally got to me. Don't worry, this won't be any harder than learning Chinese. That is elementary for me and unthinkable for you. So we're actually going to go into... The Arquido. Use our kick to the ribs. And a heavy hook and another kick to the ribs. We use the double inhale afterwards. We're going to be dodging. He's blocking, so we're going to use penetrating attacks. And break his rhythm. Reduce their energy. Let's see what happens. Going through our energy quite quickly, so it might add in that double inhale in the next round. Switch out one of the kicks for a double inhale at the end. Be great if we beat this guy first time. It'd be a good sign we're on the right track, but I don't know. Trying out a new school for the first time. Ooh. Oh. Did not save your energy, did it? Gonna need way more to be doing that much. Okay. Do the kick to the ribs. But then... Drop in a low kick. And instead of dodging, just do no defense. Dodge once. He's blocking. Break his attack. Reduce his energy. His energy's pretty low. Come on. He's just storing, he's saving his energy up. Ugh. Damn. Tough one. Look at you, helpless, like as an asteroid before the awesome might of Bruce Willis. Go back to night school. School. S C H. We'll get him. I wonder if I should stick with this school or. Let's try the other one first, the one that has been working with our Brutal Kicks. Let's unleash just all of these kicks on them. And... Penetrating Attack. Go back to the Strength. Jeez. Come on. Okay. Energy... We're at 88 still. I've still got a bunch of those kicks I can do. Should I just unleash all of those one after the other, honestly? And then switch to the other school if we get tired. Oh man, he's really beating me up. Come on. Yes! Energy depleted. Take him. Let's... We won the league, right? Let's... We won the league? Cowabunga. Learn some of that, you clown. What? Oh my god. I'm all shook up. Anyway, doesn't matter. None of it matters. You're like, so, like, basic. Yeah? As a fighter, you know? You know what I'm saying, dude? Yeah, you suck. Looks like you damaged his implants. Oops. Yeah, all you suck. 
I felt about his bell rung. Hey, Soppy, you alright? Don't call me that. Call me Boo Boo Pity Kitty. 5G Tower is really dangerous. <laughs> I won the league! I won the league! Chapter 2! Big enough. Now that's what I'm talking about. I always knew you had it in you, champ. Thanks, Silver. How about... Is that Vince McMahon? Oh my god, are we gonna start wrestling? Congratulations on your championship, kid. Thanks, you are... Yeah, who are you, Mr. Grown-Ups? What are you doing talking to my champ? You can call me Uncle Barry. And you can stop interrupting me. I manage the best. League of the City. Why do I give everyone this voice when it hurts? You've got way too much potential to keep hanging around with the amateurs. Come find me in my office. In the skyscraper. That is 100% Vince McMahon. You're not gonna listen to that buffoon, are you? We're pals, right? I'll think about it. Of course, champ. I'll be here. So I won the league. I, w I won the league. I well, I'm the silver champ. And the next thing would be up here, a new league. Let's go see what it is. <laughs> here comes a new potato for my garden. A potato? Exactly. Although, maybe you'll grow up to be a big juicy pumpkin. Or one day, who knows? Maybe even a watermelon. A pumpkin's better than a potato? Sometimes yes, sometimes no. But a watermelon isn't even a vegetable. You're reading way too much into this. The system feels kind of cobbled together. Listen, you're not here as my vegetable metaphor consultant, okay? Fruit and vegetable, you mean? Ah, listen, do you want to get to Upper City? I do. You gotta focus on fighting, not whatever that was. It's simple. Enter the professional league in second division. Oh, if you reach the top of that, you get the first. There's two more leagues. Okay. Top of the first gets 9,000 GPP. Every few weeks, go on to a better place. Basically, the Silvers League, but divisions. The fights aren't free. If you want to challenge someone with more GPP, you have to pay? What? If someone with less challenges you, they pay you. Earn money or spend it. What's in it for you? I'll take a modest fee for each of your fights. Great. Next fight's in a few days. Wow. Okay. Hey, buddy. Forgot about me already? I was thinking about you all the time, every minute. You know that, right? Here's the professional league divisions. Right now, you're in the second division. Chappie. Rorschach. Boris the Blade. Shredder. Goro Majima. Here's the fighters in the second division. No offense, you look like you're the sucker. Unusual feeling for you. I bet this guy will agree to your challenge. A new league. And a new chapter. We did it, Ma. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this first chapter of Punch Club 2. Let me know in a comment if you want to see chapter 2 and beyond in another playthrough uh, video, and I will try and do that. So let me know. Hit that like if you didn't already, and have a beautiful rest of your day.